strategy. Yes, 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 yes. The morning cup can of we, dough. Can we please silence our phones, please? Please? Can we please silence our phones? Whose phone is it? This one. Can we silence it? Yeah. Thanks. Let's go, chat. Let's go, chat. Let's go. You know the deal. When you walk in this building, you wipe your feet off at the door. That means click that like button. We don't like dirty feet in the building. It's the morning cup of dough. We about to get started. Click that like button. Click that share. It's going to go up. We got some special guests in the building today. We got our mods in the building. Mod squad in the building. Shout outs to Jay Morris and all the mods. You know, once we hit them numbers, we going into the theme song. Let's go. Knocks me off my feet. Corn, bananas, and bread. Corn, bananas, and bread. Bop, 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 bop. Yeah, 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 yeah. Corn, bananas, and pears. Okay. Let me know when it's time to go up in here, because I want all the smoke today, and it's about to be a problem. I heard you on and all everybody's, the smoke. Everybody's going to hear about this. Sounds like you got he, issues. He simultaneously wants all the smoke and none of the smoke at the same time. So I'll... Shut mm. up. <laughs> Dang, our people is coming in here late today. What's going on? Corn this, you know, the rules of morning cup of dough. Oh, we need one more. Come on, we need one more. Come on. Uno mas. Uno, Uno mas. mas. We got quotas to it's fill. Hey, hey, we're fine. We're going. Here we go. Theme song produced by Jay Morris Beats. Charlie Funk on the vocalities and East Short Sax on the saxophone. This is the Morning Cup of Dough, episode number 94. Let's go! Oops. Yeah. Oh, shit. No one is alive. Yeah. Number one. Morning show. In the entire world. This your morning, morning cup of dough. dough. This will get you going when you're moving slow. Where you at, shout it, hit the chat, tell me what you know. I'm the fact checker with the slaps. Can you be for real? I've been wildin' out to show you what the deal is. This your morning cup of dough. This will get you going when you're moving slow. Where you at, shout it, hit the chat, tell me what you know. I'm the fact checker with the slaps. Can you be for real? I've been wildin' out to tell you what the deal is. This your morning cup of dough. Let's go, chat. Let's go, Mott. It's that time. Hey, yo, Clue. That artwork got my hands looking like a whole alien. <laughs> I mean, I look like a whole monster. Alien. Jesus. What you been doing with your hands? Shut up. It's my personal business. Can we please kill the volumes on our phones, please? Police. It picks up every single time. Every single time. I don't want to be the guy. There we go. We good? Oh, oh, look who this look, look who this showed who up is. in what? this mo feezy. What's up, man? What's up? What's up? Here, man. Let, let let's link hop up in the main, man. Come come ride shotgun with the with you, the. You with don't the... Need to, if, uh, if you need to do it, nah, it's all good. We ain't even on that part yet. What's up, big homie? What's up? I came for a morning cup of dough. Morning cup of dough, man. Morning cup of dough. Good to <laughs> see you, man. It's good to be here, man. Talking to the mic, man. Oh, what's happening? We just started, man. We we just getting started, man. We having a good time. I was supposed to be in Puerto Rico. Didn't Rico. end up going, so I'm still here. But uh, it's always love, you know what I'm saying, when real kings get to connect, man. Absolutely. You know, and, and, and just to let you know, 
Doe hired me to come stand in today, and I'm here. <laughs> and I, so I, I say that to say you can trust that nigga gonna be with you. Showed, hey, I, I ain't gonna lie, cause I, it was about 11:30. I was like, man, my nigga didn't forgot about me, but you, you showed up. You always show up for me. You've never let me down in the 10 years that I've known you. So thank you for for pulling up, man. How was your weekend, man? How was how's everything going? It's well, Doe Jangles. You know, life is grand. You know, just staying busy. Okay. Shows and shit coming up, man. Netflix, April 12th. Talk to Good me about time. that. So you got Amen. you didn't even tell. Wait, side note. <laughs> Negro, I thought we was friends in real life. Well, you know, they got an NDA thing. Oh, NDA so you can't tell everybody. Yeah. So when I seen that, so you got a show coming out on um, on Netflix, an uh, 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 animated series. Tell me a little bit about that. Yeah, man, it's, it's good times. It's a reboot of it's a reboot of, of the uh, 70s show by the same name. Uh -huh. And it's a reboot, but not by much. Okay. It's, you know, it's just, you know. It has its I, own it's it own flavor. Its own group, a reimagining. Okay. A reimagining, absolutely. Okay. Oh, that was that was that was conquistador. I was wondering like, <laughs> conquistador. Oh, I was looking at why be like, what's wrong with this nigga? Oh well, shit, why did he be alright? Why did he be looking like he got out of rehab and shit? He doing good. <laughs> That nigga look like a deer in the face. Hey, <laughs> Y'all nigga... notice the nigga cut off the mustache? Oh, yeah. we're talking about it in the chat. <laughs> YDB, you gonna have like a little, little, little number on the wall that's gonna be like how many days since the last time I let him down? My... <laughs> right now, it's just four days. That's how I let Yo, you look like a different nigga, bro. Shout out to YDB. Shout man. out to Young D Bizzle in the house, man. Yeah. So, congratulations on the show too, man. Thank that's you, dope, thank man. You. That's how we hold it. Okay. Netflix is a. Uh, I mean, you, you, or you can set it down. I, I, I like that. I like that flavor. Yeah, I just like to. You know what yeah. I'm saying? We uh, that's that MC shit though. Rapping shit. You know, what yes, I'm saying? it don't absolutely. ever, it don't ever leave us. Um, everything has been going good with me though. I had a uh, had a good weekend. We had uh, Pat. Pat from All Death was in here. On, oh, yeah. Um, I saw that, man. Yeah. I saw that, man. He, shout out to Pat. Shout out wow, to Pat, man. My nigga. He my came, boy. He came through, and uh, we made a great record, man. The records have been coming through good, man. I feel like we got a, a good thing here, man. And you were really around in the very genesis of the beginning of the you know the morning show when we were like starting to put the songs together and stuff. So um, I think that we have, have found something something that might be around here for a while, man. Yeah, man. You know, again, I think the key for... One thing I, I, I like to to hey, what's good, Emperor? What's good? One thing that I like to, you know, give you your flowers about Doughboy is you know again, you are an artist, you are a creator, but you know you you never forget to have fun, and that's one thing right. that I, I've always uh, valued about our, our friendship and our, our professional relationship is that we always have fun, dog. Right. Whatever whatever yeah. it is, we're gonna have fun. We're gonna figure it out. It might not come out how we always uh, envision it, mm -hmm. but it always be fun. Absolutely. I and can't it, say one time I done did from the ADD days to now that the day was like, damn, this was a drag. Exactly. It was all good. Nah, definitely. I definitely appreciate that, man. It's a hell of a compliment coming from you, man. And um, yeah, I feel like, you know, and I know that you can, you can, um, this could resonate with you as well because you did music far before you did the comedy. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like a lot of cats don't know, Slink Capone. Right, Real right, thing, right, like right. you know what I'm saying, you was really, you know, rapping, you know, or you did this. So um, with me, it was kind of like a full circle moment. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like kind of like at the beginning of the year, I kind of was just like trying to find like, what do I want to do? And then it kind of like brought me full circle because I started doing music when I was like eight, nine years old when I started playing drums at church. So then to come back now, now that I have a show where I can be rapping every day, I'm like, oh, I... Right, right. You know, these some of these sessions be going long. We had a, a seven hour stream the other day. I'm like, I don't dream even come true. You long. know, I, I, I just want to say this to the people watching, you witnessing niggas second childhood. Tony Chantel, what's up? Thank you so much. Emperor, thank you. I appreciate y'all. What up, uh Jay Morris, man? That's love, man. Yeah, you know what I'm talking about. What up, everybody? Living my life, living my life, living my Jeff, Jeff life, life. Yeah, living Jeff my life. Jeff life, living, living my, my best life. life. <laughs> Yo, yeah. you side note. I don't know if you know your your re the record that I did with you. That uh, sometimes I be thinking about your mom. Yeah, it's one of the biggest joints that we've done. I think it's the biggest under Teddy's. <laughs> right, Dude's on, right people on. really gravitated to that man, and uh, they really rocked with it, man. But yeah, man, Miss Sea Wee. <laughs> yes. So let's talk about some other stuff, man. Yes, um, so some diff different things are going on in hip hop, man. Niggas is jumping, my boy, man. Drake. Everybody is so. First, so let me let you know what happened. Just if you don't know what happened over the weekend, because I know you be busy, you got other shit to do. No, I think but, I, that's that was pretty large. So let me tell you what happened. So Kendrick comes out and does that same shit that that's your your magic trick is getting old, Kendrick. He comes out every couple of years and he disses Drake. 
He comes out, he dishes him with Future and Metro Boomin. Metro Boomin and Drake have had an issue for, you know, they've been trading shots subliminally. We didn't know that there was anything with Future, though. But for Future to have Kendrick on his song dissing Drake was a bad sign. Now we're start, it's starting to come out now, and the information's starting to be revealed, that Drake and Future haven't liked each other for a long time. Now niggas are starting to pick sides. Rick Ross didn't unfollow Drake. Nav didn't unfollow Drake. Now <laughs> niggas is all in a, everybody. What's your take on these niggas jumping my dog, man? Because I don't like it. I I, I love it. No! I, wait, <laughs> and, 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 Let's go. I, I love it. I love it. I love it. And I'm going to tell you, I love Drake. Drake is, Drake is a super talented MC. Uh -huh. He's a dope-ass artist, man. And I'm, I'm, man, my hat's off to Drake. He, he is indeed one of the best. Mm -hmm. However, I love it. Let's bring the spirit of hip-hop back. Yeah. Now, all this unfollowing and shit, that's, that's, that, yeah, that's, that's passive-aggressive shit. Yeah, that's passive-aggressive yeah. feelings. But sometimes, yeah. you know, and, I, and, and Kendrick Trick ain't old. Sometimes, you know, <laughs> again, you sitting at the top, nigga. I let you bitch niggas get four, five years to say this shit to think I forgot, bitch. And I'm coming back, bitch. And then I'm come, he come back with a blitzkrieg on niggas, man. Just real quick. I'm not finna quick shooting to keep shooting these subs and shit. But, he, finna... but see, he does that all the time. But it's just like you come out just to say how good you are. I feel like personally. Sometimes you, everybody needs a reminder. Okay. It, it, it ain't you. You're not gonna say shit once in this game. If you live, if you got a long a career, sometimes you got to come back and remind them niggas. You see the big line sitting at the top of the plane. He chilling, minding his business. <laughs> you know, scratching his nuts and shit, and just chilling. And he see everybody running wild. Sometimes he got to come off. Sometimes he just got to let out a roar. Roar. And let niggas know. Let niggas know. What Sit the? your bitch ass down, <laughs> nigga. <laughs> I'm letting you niggas run around because my my plane of thinking, I'm, I'm on a whole different astral plane right now. So I'm going to let you niggas think you running this here realm right here. Mm -hmm. But sometimes you get a little bit too big for your britches. So I got to let you know what it is. King Kendrick, bitch. <laughs> Let's go. But this is my thing with, with Kendrick, though, right? And it, what do you think about this? Why do you think Drake hasn't just gone full-blown attack? At Kendrick on some lyrical shit. Like, do you think he's scared? He, 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 it ain't he's scared. He ain't got it in him for that. Nope. He, but he, he, he did it to Meek. Who else? Meek ain't. Uh, push it. You ain't got no answer for push it. Push it, T. You ain't got no. That's why you go around I helping all these little niggas doing singles with these young niggas so everybody be your friend. <laughs> and that's cool. <laughs> I'm finna, do, I'm finna let put a lot of niggas on, and I appreciate Drake for that. He, he right. get on a bunch of nigga songs. I appreciate it, but you know, no, he ain't got it for he got it for me, but he ain't got it for Kendrick. You know what I'm saying? He ain't got it for J Cole. I think that I think both of their I think you know you know what I'm starting to liken them as because even if they battle later down the road, this is gonna be metaphorically Manny Pacquiao and Floyd Mayweather never fighting in their primes. Mm. These niggas got to get in the ring, bro. Like, I that's why I hope Drake just says, fuck it. It just does it. Just push the button, I'm, I'm bro. A, I'm going to tell Detonate you. Detonate it. I'm going to tell you. I'm going to tell you where, why Drake, uh, uh, again, uh, although he's a great MC, mm -hmm. although he pales, why he pales in comparison to Kendrick, because Drake lacks soul. Dang. He got dope music. He talks to the ladies well. He, I never heard anybody say that. He talks Talk. to the people. When I say soul, right. that shit to get your motherfucking ass goosebumps. Yeah. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Uh, that shit that when Kendrick dropped, when he was changing his faces and shit, nigga, mm. that video wasn't nothing but him and him changing faces. And they get goosebumps today thinking about it. That's the same shit Pac had, the shit to speak to your spirit. You can speak to the bitches all you like. You can speak to the niggas in the VIP all you like. You know what I'm saying? But as you speaking to a nigga spirit, as mm. you speaking to a culture, that's why I say you can't do nothing. King Kendrick. <laughs> King. <laughs> King I, you made some, you, no, those are some valid points. And I've never really even thought about the 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 soulful element of it being so prevalent. No, you're you're definitely right. Like, and Kendrick does have, you know, a lot of a lot of soul in his music. I love it, like you said. I love the compared the competitive fervor of hip hop, so I hope that they get into the ring. And I just I think it'll be good for hip hop. Just let's j I just want to see the fight now because you niggas have been dissing each other for years. Get it over with, get in the ring, fight, and then just 
Man, would it be even what colder is? getting over, getting in the ring and doing a video, doing the Ooh. song, dissing each other on the same song and doing the Ooh. video. Who did that back in the day? Who who put two people on the same song and then one of them niggas dissed the other person? It was Young Buck put was it T.I. and Ludacris on the same top on the same song? And then yeah. Ludacris was like, please get off the T.I. Like, then he dissed yeah, yeah. T.I. So maybe we take it back to nigga. But, but the only thing about that was T.I. had already sent his verse in, so he didn't get to diss it, it came, him on that it, one. It can't be sneaky. It can't be, yeah, yeah, it that one be some a little kind sneaky. of way where you, both, both people turn their verse in at the same time. Same time. You, you, one can't turn the verse in and then get a chance for the other. You know, get exactly. To get, to get the drop on the nigga. Yeah, so we turn their verse in at the same time. And... Um, you know, I think that'll be the fair way to do it. Uh, I think they get them, yeah, that's the only way to do it. Somebody turn their verse in at the same time to a, 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 a neutral party. Right. You know what I mean? And then put the record and out. And then put that motherfucker out. Or, or yeah, or just going live. Same beat, though. They, that's they, what they all giving the same beats ahead of time. But they, see, I don't think, do you think, do you think niggas got the heart to do that? Do you think niggas would do that? I think King Kendrick do. I would love to see them just uh, just for the sake of hip hop come out and and do it. But shout out to both of them. They're both, you know what I'm saying, amazing artists. All that. You see Kendrick? You that? see Kendrick? That nigga Kendrick, a lot of times I see Kendrick, that nigga whole outfit about a hundred dollars. Don't fuck with that man. <laughs> Cause I mean, you know the nigga pockets is lined up. The nigga pockets is lined right, up. He but got yeah. it to do, but he's right. no, that nigga, I'm just saying it's, yeah. to speak to the common man. You know yeah. what I'm saying? The way Kendrick speak to the common man, to the soul, you see that nigga at a whole fucking award show with half his braids undone. That's true. You know what I'm saying? Some regular shit. You know but what I'm talking about? My, he don't wear no motherfucking lip balm. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> what? There was other rappers wearing lip balm? I mean, ain't nothing, niggas wrong, do with, ain't nothing wrong with lip balm. But some niggas <laughs> but he be over-applying the that, lip yeah. balm, my Niggas nigga. do over-apply lip balm. Yeah, yeah, you can't have niggas that would be And it'd be time. hard. I don't, and I say that at the same time to say I don't like, you know, even to mention the niggas' lips, but it's when they that <laughs> dominant, they prevalent. I only, you bringing attention to your lips. Why? My nigga. Yeah, why would you do that? Them exactly. My nigga. And it's cool. You know what I'm saying? Your shit's shiny, my nigga. Your right. shit look like a Mylar balloon. I don't want to see them motherfuckers <laughs> like that, man. Nah, man. So listen, I, you know, so that was the first part of what I wanted to talk about, right? So Drake got smoked. With a lot of artists right now, right? I and now I, I, I'm not to interrupt. One more there, time. And in Drake's defense, you know, when you at the top, right? People, you know, he, he come with the territory. And he's been arguably on top for 15 years. Mm -hmm. There ain't no other rapper done that. So, so I wanted to. This is actually apropos that you're here to talk about this because I definitely want to hear what you have to say about this lifestyle change that I'm about to embark upon. Okay, so. Just like Drake got smoke with some some people, I got smoke. I got smoke with smoke. What I mean is, <clears throat> look at the face. <laughs> oh, look at the face. All I've, the smoke. I've come to the conclusion. Uh huh. No pun intended. That, and this is how I came to the conclusion. I was watching the the um the morning cup of those last week and i was just watching just the episodes and bro i'm like chain smoking blunts like chain smoke like i went through an ounce of weed in a day and a half good weed and i said to myself i'm having that cross addiction thing that i had back in the day when i got when i stopped eating food because you knew me when i got the weight loss surgery when I stopped eating food, then I started drinking way too much. And when I seen myself on the camera, I was just like, all right, though, um, you're going to have to quit. So I came, like, I, 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 I've I, been thinking about this for a while. So it wasn't just like a, a, a fly off the handle decision. It was like, what is weed doing for me? How does it affect my mental health? How does it affect my physical health? Does it do anything for me good? And when I couldn't find the right answers that I needed for it, I said, you know what? I'm quitting. So last day, yesterday was my last day of smoking weed and I'm uh, no longer smoking weed, man. How you feel about that? I see your face. Yeah. I don't know how to feel. What, what's, what's going on in that head of yours, man? What's, how you feel? More for us. <laughs> you ain't part of the smoke yards crew. No boy. 
<laughs> Get him, <laughs> Get him. <laughs> Talk to me, man. You're my big bro. No, boy, I tell you, man. More power to you, man. Whatever make you happy. If mm. that's what's going to make you the best you. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because what we'll, we'll, we'll work for one won't we'll necessarily work for another when I'm growing up to say that. Mm -hmm. And, you know, more power to you. I wish you well on your journey. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? I'm still for the smoke mom. Oh, yeah, for sure. <laughs> for sure. <laughs> but, you know, much much love on your yeah. journey. And, 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 you know, shit, man. Whatever you need to be the best, though. Whatever you feel that it's going to take for you to be your happiest, your mm -hmm. best, your most productive. Yeah. That's how you're gonna be your, your most productive is when you're happy. You, yeah. And and that's a and, and I want to take this moment to to speak to that because I've been dealing with that a little bit uh as myself, not in, in regards to smoking marijuana, mm -hmm. but, but being happy. And I tell everybody out there, do what you need to do to be happy. Sometimes you're even gonna hurt somebody else's feelings, but you gotta do what you need to do to be happy. At the end of the day, you need to be happy. True. And you ain't hurting my feelings by not smoking no weed. As long as you keep some in the studio for us. Oh, for sure. I'm not tripping. Oh, for sure. And, and, yeah, and, I, and I'm not one of those people, right, that's like, once I stop smoking, every time I see you, I'll be like, hey, Slick, what are you doing smoking? Like, nah, do what you do. But, you know, it was just what, what I'm thankful for more than anything is that I'm starting to be more self aware the older I get. So I was just able to see it. Like even with Red Bulls, I was one episode, I had like five Red Bulls. I was just like, bro, you, like that thing that you, like I have this like imbalance that just happens that just will now, overcompensate now for thing, things. Now the thing about it now mm -hmm. is sometimes, man, it ain't about alleviating that imbalance. Sometimes it might be uh, redirecting that imbalance. That's what I'm trying to do. You know, yes. Let this be your passion. Let this be your blunt. Let mm -hmm. this be your red bull. Yes. You know what I'm saying? Let this be your muse. Let this be whatever the fuck it is you need to be because ain't nothing wrong with that because everybody likes some and mm -hmm. got to quit knocking people for what they like if that's what you like nigga that's what you like yeah you know what i'm talking about it just you know keep man going. look at you man i thought i mean i, I, mean, I know i mean i know you enough off of camera <laughs> to know that that's really the real way you know you feel about things but yeah man that definitely makes me feel makes me feel good man and i'm just gonna um just gonna take it you know one day at a time with it like you know what i'm saying like you know if you, you see me smoking next week don't man, fry got, me but you know i'm, I'm you, gonna try my best you got it. exactly yeah. and, and 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 that's why also i say you know again because we doing what we doing this is the business of what we doing mm -hmm. and it's okay but i say sometimes too man work on it first right you know sometimes you sometimes it's best to work on it first because you put yourself under too much pressure right if not smoking was something you wanted to do Kind of keep it in your mind and work on it because you because when you when you fall after you made them kind of announcements, people are going to scrutinize you. Oh yeah, 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 you know definitely. What I'm saying? And, and, and it'll always be, it don't always be constructive criticism. Oh, you know, curtain. I know far it too be well. Scrutiny. Oh yeah, yeah. You know, yeah, they'll use so, it against you. Right. Yeah, yeah. So now nah, it's just um, it's just something to where like even with the people that you know tune into us every day, like you know, I just didn't want them to just be like, hey, that, no boy, roll the blinton. In three weeks, Miss Kiwi TV, <laughs> as Miss Kiwi TV, Kiwi, Miss Kiwi. Okay, uh, I, I'm, I'm, I, my mother was an English teacher. The C, the C is not hard. <laughs> uh, after, be, oh. Before I <laughs> Miss Kiwi TV, we want dough at its best, most optimal self. Yes. Amen to that, man. Can That's we what get I want to be. Can we get an applause, applause real quick, real quick? Uh, hey, That's all it is, man. So yeah, I'm excited about it, but you know it ain't nothing more than a. Uh, than a one-day game plan. You know what I'm saying? That's all I ever really do with anything anyway, just one-day game plan. So all that good stuff. What else is going on in life, though, man? You been killing these shows on the road? Oh, yeah, having man. Having fun? I'm, I'm having fun, man. April 4th, I'm in Atlanta. April 28th, I'm in Fort Worth. I'm in L.A. April 20th, April 19th. Where you at on the 20th in L.A.? Downtown uh, at, the, at the rooftop of some of my Instagram. Check out my Instagram I'm page. Pull up. Okay. You know, look through it. Okay. Uh, I'm very happy. I came today. I, I didn't think you was going to be here, so I was, you know, going to ask uh, why do you be and in conclusion to work with me on some shit after we finish the show. So oh, no, I hope got you. Things can. Like, hey, no, we got Horse. you. Uh, why, <laughs> for sure. Like you I, know that was it. already the plan. We wasn't gonna change the plan at all. It's just you was just gonna I was gonna do have that. my ugly mug in I, here with Yeah, because I'm kinda disappointed <laughs> because you're here and you're still I ain't ugly. gonna be disappointed because I'm at work. <laughs> because you're here and you're still ugly. The nigga I, put, <laughs> I put on my new everything gold sweatsuit, man. Shout out to my nigga M E P man. Y'all make sure y'all get everything goes, man. I'm gonna do me a sketch in my everything goes sweatsuit, man. Shout out to my man. I need some of that too. Everything yeah. goes. I'm his friend too, man. Yeah. Let me EP, get some too. EP, hook my man, dope boy. I need some up, man. One X, because I'm in the gym <laughs> these days. Hey, um, you know what? Speaking of which, bro, I don't know what the fuck is going on. <laughs> hmm. 
But I went to see the Brad Jordan experience over the weekend at the Garden Grove Amphitheater. Scarface's uh, tour. The he Brad, has an experience? He has an experience. Oh, wow. The Brad Jordan experience, a whole live band, uh, how many piece ensemble, I don't know. But it's a bunch of motherfuckers, a bunch of very talented motherfuckers, singers and musicians, mm -hmm. bringing you the Brad Jordan experience. And I went and I, I, I enjoyed the concert, man. It was a great time. Great time reunited with my friend Brad. You know, it was dope. Yeah, I seen you post. Like, that's actually a personal friend of yours. That's a friend of mine. Nice. Man. Brad is dope, man. Mm -hmm. uh, and I say that to say, you know, in the post I said, you know, I've, I've been a fan since 1990. I started rapping, and I got signed to Too Short in 97. And around 98, 99, you know, Too Short and Face is tight. So I was around 98, 99, I started seeing Face a lot. And, you know, well, that's just around the time I think he remembered my name. And ever mm -hmm. since then, we was always cool. Brad answered the phone for a nigga. Like, I say that, that's big. Uh, I know a lot of these Hollywood niggas, and they is not answering the phone. Come on. They is not re returning texts. Talk to them. A lot of these Hollywood niggas, a lot of these rap niggas, I know they be cool on Instagram, but they not returning calls or texts. Nigga, I don't even be asking you for shit, for my real. nigga. Niggas I just, I <laughs> niggas mean, just I be Hollywood cool. Yeah, they niggas Hollywood. Niggas don't want to pick up the phone. Like, I mean, yeah. that's cool. I could be Hollywood cool, too, but <laughs> right. I just acknowledge, you know, when, when I want to bring flowers to my real friends and right. people that really will, 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 like, I hit face and he don't pick up, he's going to call me back. Right. He's going to text me back something. And I appreciate that. That's real friends and not right. Hollywood fake. Hollywood nah, friends. Definitely. And I love that you know the fact that you you know you gave him his flowers on that and that's really the same way i look at you like you know what i'm saying like i was like a fan of yours a fan of black jesus and like when we start like when we linked and we did uh 12 hours of blood back in 2014 10 years ago like i didn't know that like this nigga would be my friend like you know so i could call you about stuff that has nothing to do with any of this shit and you'll pick up and so like yeah i, I definitely can can identify with you know what i'm saying just being cool with people that you're a fan of because what I've learned is and I've learned this a lot in being in the industry it's nothing more heartbreaking than being a fan of a nigga and meeting him and he's an asshole bro they say there's nothing it, it hurts like they, they say you don't want not you they say that a lot of times you don't want to meet your legends bro you don't you don't want to meet them you just want to keep them where they at you don't want to meet them because these niggas is different but before I forget what I, my point I'm trying to always remember that mm -hmm. I brought up the face concert and all that one one I was there with my boy big pit law and my man uh Marcel who was there chilling law I went to the merch booth to give me a 2X sweatshirt. They ain't had nothing. I was mad. My boy went to the merch booth. He bought the last sweatsuit they, sweatshirt they had, and it was a 1X. And do you know that motherfucker fit? Mm. You know, I, so hey, I, I just say, my I, just, boy's out here. I say that was, a, that, that, that was just a big 1X. I'm right. talking about the sleeves was good. So shout out to Scarface. If you haven't, go check out the Brad Jordan experience when it come to your town. He got merch that fit. Dope. He got big merch. So, so you've seen him at the uh, Garden Amphitheater? Yes, sir. Yes, Damn, sir. Damn, man. I wanted to go to that. Shout yeah. out to my boy Droops. He throws those out the house productions. Yeah, that was fire, man. He performed with the whole band and everything. Living my Jeff life. Yes, I was. Man, yeah. yep, that, that, that shit was live, though. That shit was live. Yeah, shout I out. I've seen the shout footage. Out. Yeah, man. Well, shout out to that, man. I'm glad you had a good time over the weekend. So we're, uh, we're pulling up to about 1230 right now. I think we're going to... Um, Bring our our special other guest, our special guest, in here. Why don't we do this? How how are we gonna go? How about until until it's time for a cook up? Okay, cool. All right, for sure. Yeah, okay, yeah, you can have about too. Okay, all right. Um, can we get Blizzy most to the stage? Oh 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 oh! oh. To the donut room. You're standing on it. You're standing on it. Hey. Oh, big ass size, seventeen feet ass. Right. Boy, hey, if y'all want to smoke, smoke Super in the giant. Smoke, smoke in the Teddy Ray room. So coming to the donut room, we have Blizzy Most making his way from Philadelphia, Philly. Philly's in the house. Philly. Didn't bring no cheesesteaks, but you, you know could, what you I'm saying. You're still welcome. <laughs> hey, uh, YDB, can you take these, please? Low key, when I used to have my boys come from Philly, I used to really have them okay. bring Philly cheesesteaks on it. Psh, man. Blizzy, hey, hey guys, the, the mics are picking up everything. Blizzy, what it do, my guy? It's Blizzy Mo, right? Blizzy Mo. Blizzy Mo's. With a T? Or no. just Mo's? With a T. With a T. So Blizzy Most. I'm the most. Where'd you come up with the name from? Can you talk to the mic for me? Tell, tell me, how'd you come up with the name Blizzy Most? Ah, it was actually a friend of mine. Yeah, okay. I mean, all world. He's a uh, Quest Love's uh, hype man when he does DJing gigs around the country. Okay. Shout out to Yeah, I mean. Nice. Ah, um... I used to have a rap name back when I was in the rap group 
Okay. The Humanicans. And I used to go by Blizz. Okay. But it was so many people that had the name Blizz when I tried to do a search to, to own the name mm -hmm. to get the rights to it. Um, so right before I did it, I released a song. Um, my, I used to see Yamin. He worked for me at the same company. Uh, we, we worked for his marketing firm together. Okay. So he used to always be like, yeah, Blizzy. Mm -hmm. Blizzy, you the most Blizzy, and sometimes I was so like, it always be calling you Blizzy the most, so the most fill in the blank, the most Blizzy. Uh huh. What's up? And I was like, hmm, that that, that might that might work a little something. Let me Got say, it. and I did a check. Nope. It was open. It was open. Nice, and it just stuck. And it stuck. And how long you been rocking with that moniker? Ooh. A couple years this, at this point. Ooh, like twenty years. Hey, Ugh. man, you look, you don't look but twenty five yourself, <laughs> man. This guy here. All right, man. So let's get into it, man. Let's let's talk about some things, man. Let's break it down. Let's get into uh, first where you come from, where you're from. So you're from, you're originally out of Philly, right? West Philadelphia. West yeah. Philadelphia. Born, Born and raised. Raised. Well, well, playground is where you spent most of your days. Some of them. Okay, some of some, them. Though. Summertime. Now, okay, I always used to wonder hey. about that. Like when I used to watch Fresh Prince. And he talked about the basketball game that was a, a fight was so bad that he had to move across the country. Where the bat, where the where, was the basketball that competitive in Philadelphia back in the day for uh, him to have to do this? Geez. I mean, it still is competitive. Oh, yeah, so it but really it was is a, a thing. Yeah, but I don't think that was his back. That was that was a the guy, the producer of the show. That oh, okay, so that, that was, was his, his moniker, thing. Benny okay. Medina. Benny Medina. That so, was so he got. Put in the blender. He, he got <laughs> was like, man, we got to ship him out of here. But I don't know where he's from. So gotcha. yeah, he, he ran out. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Okay, so you're born and raised in Philly, west side of Philly. Walk me through like maybe the first 10 years of your life. Like, do you have any any siblings? Like, what was life like? What kind of kid were you? Kind of tell me what life was first 10 years of Blizzy's life. Ooh, um, I mean, Philly was, it was a different time then. It was not a lot of violence like that like mm -hmm. what's going on now it was it was cool i had great summers hanging out you know i got two brothers mm -hmm. so older brothers I older so you're the youngest i'm the youngest oh, okay or as my mom would say the baby baby boy <laughs> gotcha <laughs> rest mom dude so okay gotcha gotcha um uh, i just remember uh, fun times looking forward to the summer Okay. Things is a lot more of a community. And what type of stuff were you into as a kid? Like, were you more into sports? Was it music? Were you a writer? Like, what kind of things gave you pleasure as a young Blizzy? Um, I was a shorter guy. I'm not saying that I'm like six <laughs> Right. I was little. So I gotcha. couldn't really play basketball because uh -huh. I couldn't palm the ball. That uh -huh. was kind of hard for me. But everything else, I was pretty good. Like, football, unbelievably pretty fast. You know, I was... Gotcha. Yeah, baseball and all that, but definitely football. Okay. So first 10 years of your life, you're, you know, you got your older brothers, you're making your way through, you know, West Philly, whatever, whatever. Um, does music kind of come into the first 10 years of your life or are you still kind of not really introduced to it yet? Uh, no. Nah. Um, okay. I actually joined, uh, when I got in junior high school, I started wanting to get in the band. Okay. Seeing stuff, but I used to I played the violin first, just nice. to have an instrument, just to come home with. Cause I was like, How did you pick, How did you come up with picking that? That just doesn't normally seem like what the brothers would do. You, I, I just went for give me a violin. That was okay. the first thing I could get, I think of to get something to take home. I okay, got gotcha. Violin, so, Where, but, did you get nice at it? Like, were you uh, decent? No. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, that's one thing I've never I've never even tried. Cause I was just like, eh. uh, no, I'm just not gonna look right doing it. No. Nah, okay, so you weren't so you weren't good at it. Not at all. Okay. Well, Not at all. Well, okay. So it, it, I probably lasted about a week and a half. Oh, well, then you don't even know if you could have been good. Uh, I didn't like. It. Okay, so it, like, it, 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 it didn't, didn't, it didn't grab muscle. you. Gotcha, right. gotcha. So, okay. Um, so I remember the lady calling my house, asked mm -hmm. my mom, like, why he doesn't want to come in and, and, and finish his violin lessons and stuff. He was like, no, he's not interested. So I can't make him come in if he doesn't want to do it. Right. But I went to the. What do you call it? French horn next. Okay. Which one is the French horn? It's not the clarinet. It's French horn. It's like it's curved? Brass, curved brass oh, brass nobody brass. plays that. I know. That's why I <laughs> so you went for the one that nobody plays. Uh, again, Did you have better luck with this one? No. Oh, okay, so you're over two. Actually, I was better. I okay. was a little better, but it still wasn't what I connected with. So okay. it's like, I, again, it was something cool to take home. Look, oh, I got an instrument to bring. Gotcha, home. gotcha. So, so but I did a little better. I stayed for, for about a month. Okay. And then I was like, I went to one of our concerts before I actually got to play, and mm -hmm. I saw guys playing the drums. I was like, Whew. 
that's where that's because that's where I started. I went straight to drums. You know what I'm saying I started playing at like ten, and I was I, already I was all in, beating on the tables mm-hmm. at the kitchen table. Mm-hmm. So I know. So when you started playing drums, was it snare? Was it like a single instrument, or was it the set? That's exactly. That's how we learned first. Okay. Single instruments first. Mm-hmm. Going to snare drum, the bass drum. And are you playing this in the band? Uh, yeah. Is uh, it a concert band? Because this is, is it still middle school or are you now in high school? That's still middle school. And so now it's like a concert band, right? Where you got timpanis and all the other shit. Yeah. So it, you're not moving in formations. You're just yeah. playing like in the, yep. the, the auditorium, whatever that is. Okay. So you're, <laughs> you're playing. So now you're getting a little bit better and you're playing drums. You're playing the different stuff that they have back there. Because normally with the drums in a concert band, you, you just got a lot of stuff. And it's not necessarily that difficult right. when you're in middle school. Normally, it gets a little bit harder in high school because then you get around all the people that have been playing for all the years. Yeah. But you can kind of be a little bit more experimental yeah. in middle school. So so you're, I'm assuming you're doing that. You're playing with the bass, drum, maybe triangle, temple blocks, whatever else you might be doing. Yeah, all of that. All that stuff. So then you make it through. Now you're in high school. Tell me what changes in high school. Um, There was a, a drum program called Synsonic Drums. Okay. First, like, drum machine I had. So mm-hmm. I think once I got that one Christmas, I would just, I lived with that. Game was over. I lived. I went to sleep with that. It's in mm. the bed. <laughs> <laughs> and this is old school, so it didn't even, what, it just give you like a four-bar loop? Did you have to like put it on a tape? Like, how are you even transferring what you were making? It gave you about four bars. Okay. It had, it had some buttons. It was a square thing. It had buttons on it, and it had four uh, pads. Okay. So you could hit the pads that sound like a snare drum, a bass drum with, mm. uh, with like drumsticks and stuff like that. Right. But, or you could use the buttons, so I just use the buttons okay the buttons. but it was like a four par, a four bar loop so you could get so so now you're starting to get your early you know taste of sequencing and producing mm-hmm. you know with this machine that you have okay so then walk me through the high school experience are you getting more into music now are you meeting other people who do music like what's the vibe of music now i actually went to block parties with a guy who was a really good dj in philly. and those are big in philly right block parties block parties yeah because they don't do those out here nah, like, it'd be yeah. wild yeah, <laughs> <man. laughs> Should <it be>? shut <laughs> the fuck up but but in philly it was cool so y'all would have these oh, block parties block parties block, okay. block the streets off for like three three or four blocks oh like is that what will was talking about when he did summertime he was talking about this oh okay but, but he was parties. talking about the plant till we did it like a block party but he did he mentioned block parties also gotcha yeah. gotcha okay yeah. okay so okay so now you're starting to move a little bit more you're meeting more people you're you know what i'm saying so what is it that you're starting to hone your musical capabilities on is it mostly like you're starting to be known as a rapper producer drummer like what is it that you're starting to do more than anything else in high school oh more than yeah, being a, a drum okay gotcha drum sequencer okay that was the guy so a lot of dudes in the summertime when i had the time or whenever they were it really good rappers would have me come. Okay. Uh, them DJs also would have me come to block parties or little shows, and mm-hmm. I'd make a drum beat, and they played over it in a rap. So you would do it live? Yeah. Oh, nice. Okay, so you Big was sequence. Do, 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 do. And so you was just just in the mix like that. Yeah. Okay. So then, so I know that his name has come up a couple of times in this, but the Will Smith angle. How did you meet Will Smith? How did you? How did like? How did the Will Smith thing come about? Wow. Um, actually, it was a guy I went to high school with, Omar. Okay. He was, he was doing stuff with them. He was like this. When they first started, they're only dancing. Okay. I mean, he'd be in New York dancing by on stage by himself. And this is when Will was rapping? When he was rapping. And he had one he, dancer? Yeah, he had okay. one ja- dancer. Okay. One dancer. Sometimes the guy who used to be with them, who was a beatbox guy, Ready Rock Talking to the mic. I'm sorry. Are you good? Uh, Ready Rock C. He okay. would do stuff with them, too. He uh-huh. was... Uh, original uh part of the group he did the beatbox and all that uh, you know gotcha that's another story <laughs> <laughs> um but yeah that guy we went to high school together omar shout out to omar okay. Rambert. um we went to high school together we kind of always seen each other around when i got when i got to college and went to a lot of college parties it was huge especially up like homecomings and stuff on the east coast so mm-hmm. we would go and house music was big right so it was from like doing the butt kind of stuff then to house music mm-hmm. in like the late 80s early 90s early 90s right so that's I back ran, everybody was wearing biker shorts and shit 
<laughs> doing the butt. What were we doing? I was super young back then, but I just, now that I look back at the butt, I was like, that was a wild time for him. It was just a bunch of people shaking their ass in biker shorts, and everybody was okay with it. It was yeah. different times. Yeah, that was different times. <laughs> different times. Different times. Biker shorts first exactly. came out. When you really you think know, about it, like, we was wearing biker shorts and fanny packs. I didn't wear biker shorts. I never wore I never wore biker My shorts. thighs was not for no biker shorts. I was not wearing no biker shorts, but the fact that other grown men were, it was just a whole thing. And I just remember the video was like doing the butt, like, okay. But in any event, so <laughs> the music's starting to pop off, it's starting to blow. And then your boy is working, your boy Omar is working with Will as a dancer. Yeah. Now walk me through, like, does he come to you like, hey, so were you dancing at this time too? Um, I was dancing. He seen me around, I was okay. good. And I was a gymnast, so I combined gymnastics, doing gymnastics. You got a lot of skills. You, <laughs> you got the trapeze, the French horn, everything, <laughs> drums, this nigga, multi talented in here. I wanted to try uh, a little bit of everything. Gotcha, man. gotcha. So, so he knew that you had some skills. So, did he like set up a meeting for you to meet him? Like, how did that come about? No, this is how it happened. Okay, I, I, you know, I knew Omar was doing stuff with them dancing, uh -huh. and I seen uh, I was watching MTV. Looking at it, turning. Oh, okay. What's it? Whoa, whoa, whoa. That's Will. That's Jeff. Dang, that's Omar. Dang, that's Ready Rock. Right? I was like, So this oh. has to be culture shock to you. Like, I know these niggas. I know them. <laughs> like, I know them all. I'm like, How are they on MTV? Right. I said, I know what Omar sometimes be at all the homecomings. Mm. I was like, I'm going to start going and I'm going to link up with Omar. I got to be on the TV with these dudes. Wow. And how old were you at this time? You were like 18, nine. how old are you at yes. this time? So you're just fresh out of high school? 17, 16, 17. Got you, yeah. got you. So you said, all right, I know niggas, I'm going to meet niggas. Oh, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm going to show niggas what I'm on. Yeah. Okay, so then how? walk me through how that happens. I ended up seeing them at like Lincoln University on coming one year, so okay. Omar. And he seen me in a circle. We used to have circles and battle. We broke dance. We did dance battles? Stuff, do house music. Oh, yeah, we got it in. Really? <sighs> Yeah, I was never a great dad. I mean, I know you can't tell by looking at me, but I've never... <laughs> I was thinking but no, I've that never, you... <laughs> I've never been a great dad. No, don't get it <laughs> twisted. But man, he used to uh, work with this guy who's a dance legend out of Philly, uh, uh, Rennie Harris, uh, uh, my man, uh, Tron, Tron uh -huh. Anderson. He was a he always a heavier dude. I mean, Heavy D, of, Heavy D was, was my was my inspiration as a child. There you go. But I just could never do what yeah. he did. So, yeah. But you had skills in dance, and so, yeah. so y'all used to get into these... Big ass circles and dance. Yep. And, dance. and was you like taking people's heads off in I these was, battles? I was taking heads. Okay. Cool. I was doing flips over cats, doing stuff, all kind of gymnastic stuff, and then okay. all the house moves and stuff like that. So. And is Will present while you're doing this, no. watching it? Okay, so you're just doing Omar, this in front. Yeah. Omar sees it though. Omar sees it. Uh, like, oh, oh, hold up. This shit is real. I didn't know you was get down like that. So we talked, linked up. It was some stuff that he was supposed to have me do with him for Disney, mm. but it, it never panned out. So. Got it. Maybe like a year, a year after that, I waited for something. Then there was a guy from Philly. His name was Han Soul. He went to Temple University. Mm -hmm. He had a single deal back when people used to get singles. Okay, single yeah. deals. People used yes. to get deals off singles. Singles, maxi yes. singles. They had like four or five remixes of that one song. So mm -hmm. Han Soul, he brings me in. Like I got a project. Uh, can you do the choreography for me? Like with, well, actually with him, help him. I had and that's fun. where you, where you. Um basically choreograph the stuff for other dancers yeah okay gotcha yep so mm -hmm. he said but i need two girls and i knew two girls and mm -hmm. i used to dance at all the house spots the college parties whatever a couple clubs that play house music mm -hmm. and uh i got them we got together we did the choreography and they loved it so uh, we were just supposed to choreograph it and then that was it and the girls were going to dance but they was like we need everybody right that was hot we want everybody wow <laughs> and, and then uh as time went on when his budget when we did parties you know he was just getting up the charts on dance charts so he ain't had no real budget so mm -hmm. they can only afford two dancers to go places around up and down the east coast so it was like me and omar so they, they oh so you guys would be actually dancing on stage while he's performing the songs yeah wow so how long did this did this go on because i mean from, from what i understand too you did you did you ever work on the uh fresh prince of bel air too did you ever like maybe get an episode in there or something or anything to that effect yeah down okay down. Okay, so talk, tell me about yeah, that. Yeah. Um, wow. So once I got on with that, did uh, the Han Soul thing, then I started dancing with him for uh, Will and Jeff. Okay. And I got to be honest, I was kind of like not excited at first because I was like, How come? 
Because he was pretty big at the time, right? Yeah, but I was like, so I got to feel what I'm dancing to. I need to make sure if it, it moves. Right. I mean, for like brand new funk back in the day, that that was hot. Right. Stuff like that. And then like, it was, I think I, I could beat Mike Tyson or something like that. And I was Right. Like, just not the stuff that you're necessary. Or you yeah. saw my blinker, bitch. Or just maybe in those <laughs> different records. But it's just whatever it was, it wasn't connecting with yeah, you I didn't at get the time. To, right. It uh, didn't connect with me. I yeah. just did. I was just kind of like, I do it, but I, was, I wasn't excited about it until right. I heard Summertime. Summertime was, was a one. Yeah. To this day, that might be in my top 10 songs all time. People don't understand this about me and Will Smith, right? Will Smith is a huge part of the reason I rap. I was a, a, a avid fan of his rapping. Wow. Before, like, I'm talking about Nightmare on My Street, Parents Just Don't Understand, You Saw My Blink. Like, he was like, it was like he was the first rapper to me that was like rapping about regular stuff. Like, it was just so damn broken down and spoon fed to me. Like, so even like back in the day, like, and Summertime is literally in my top 10 of favorite songs. Okay, I digress. So you guys are on the road, you're, you're, you're dancing with him, but you're not fully vested into the music that he has until Summertime comes out. What changes when Summertime comes out? Um... Just hearing it, I, I didn't even think it was him. I was like, "What is this?" He played it at a re we were rehearsing, and yeah. I was like, "What? What? What, 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 what the fuck is this? <laughs> Play that again?" Right. I was like, "I was like, who is this? Like De La Soul or Rakim?" He was like, "That's Will, new single, <sighs> Summertime." I was like, "All right, I'm in. <laughs> I'm in. It's time to I, I'm go. In. <laughs> I'm in. I'm in. hundred percent. So that changes everything. So then you hit the road, and so I'm assuming." They they had to work that record for at least six months. It was the biggest record, at least for the summer. Like, I'm I'm assuming there was a lot of work off of that one record. No, um, believe it or not, not as much as the following uh, album he had with Boom Shake the Room. Oh wow! That's... But I mean, it did big around the country. Uh huh. Boom Shake the Room. It got him, in, you know, around the country. It was a dance hit and in Europe. So gotcha. That's I got to go to Europe from that. Okay. And so then after, you know, after that, so you're working with Will, then when, then talk to me about when you actually got to work on the show. Like, did you, like, when you worked on, when you did, so did you do an episode ever? Were you acting in it? Talk to me about your, your experience with um, Fresh Prince of Bel-Air. Um, well, once I moved out here, I was around a lot. So mm -hmm. after, while we were doing stuff, I would go to the set of the show and uh, the, the stage manager, I got cool with Maynard. And uh, mm -hmm. he used to just, you want to, be an extra on something. I was like, yeah. <laughs> I was kind of like, yeah, why? Right. But I was like, yeah, I'll do it. Right. Cool. Then a lot of friends of mine seen me on it and they were like, oh, I seen you on the show. Oh, that was cool. I'll do it more. <laughs> right. Yeah. It's just a cool thing to do. Yeah. Right. And then one time he was pledging for a fraternity. Uh huh. Uh, Will and Carlton. Okay. And uh, the guy needed people to be the pledges with him. So. Mm -hmm. I end up being one of the pledges. So they wow. So you've had a pretty locked in, dialed in situation just from humble beginnings coming from Philly and just something as simple <laughs> as seeing your man on MTV being like, man, I'm finna. And look, you know, 20, 30 years later, you know what I'm saying? You're still living in your purpose, still doing things that you're, you know, you're passionate about. We were talking off camera. So you DJ a lot of different corporate events, different stuff now. So what is your life like now on a day to day basis? And where does music play a part in your life these days? Eesh. Um, I was doing a lot of like house music, so mm -hmm. it, and that that came by default. I was a house head. I used to go to the club, but mm -hmm. I made a song with a, a friend of mine. We were like, hey, we had a group. We were rapping, and, and she mm -hmm. was singing. Okay, and um, for fun, we made a house track. Mm -hmm. So it picked up. Uh, it got put on a label, and uh, being a, a Billboard charted song for like a couple weeks. Wow. How does that feel, man, to have a song that was on a billboard, man? That's got to feel great. Yeah. It, it was cool. I, <laughs> you guys such a cool demeanor, like, oh, man. No, it was, it was cool. I didn't, I didn't realize right. what it meant at the time. Right. I kind of dropped the ball. Didn't do as much DJing as I should have done then mm -hmm. to uh, kind of get on top of that because I didn't know DJing would be, like, as huge as it is now. Right. And do you still, like, do you still produce music? Like, do you still bust out the keys every now and again? Like, is it still... 
a creative muse for you to, you know what I'm saying, kind of maybe use as like a stress reliever or different things like that? Like, do you still kind of tinker around with it every now and again? No, I, 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 I do it. Oh, yeah, really you, do it. yeah. You really do it? No, I really do. I still got, I, every now and then, it's over the past 10 years, I put up a, a, like one or two songs a year. I'll oh, okay. Well, okay. So, so let me music. understand fully then. So you say, so you're still actively, yeah. the music is still coming out. Yeah. Actively. Yeah, I'm still producing for uh, house Producing artists, for other like, artists and still yeah. putting out stuff. Yeah. So how does that feel, man? Because see, like, that's the thing, like, kind of like, you know, you, you kind of heard me alluding to, you know, to the guys um, before we we're on air. Um, and actually when I was on air too. But, um, you know, music was always like my first love. You know, comedy kind of just came right. later in life. But, you know what I'm saying? I think that it's something that, and I don't know if you, you know, if you feel this way, but you can speak to it, you know, what's your opinion on this. But I feel like music to me is very therapeutic. Like, it's better for me. Like, I don't. I don't look to do music for like monetary gain. Like, yeah, of course, if somebody wants to give me millions of dollars for doing it, I'll take it. But like, I can express myself in a different way. And like, I can, like, even with like the songs that we be doing, like, and I'll play a couple of them for you before we go into the next segment of the show. But it's just like, I can listen to a song that I've done and feel physically better from listening to it. Do you have that kind of relationship with music? Like when you do it, like explain your relationship to music to me. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Um, and mainly it comes from like being connected with house. I was so against it. Mm -hmm. And so like, ah, and then once I connected with house, I, if you ever seen people dance to it, they're almost like entranced spiritual. Okay. So they spiritually connect, connect to the, to the music. So, and, and, and it's crazy. So I love that feeling of when I danced with house and how mm -hmm. I connect. And I like to see how people connect with it. And when I made a couple of tracks, being as though I know what I would like to dance to once I was able to learn the craft and making music and doing mm -hmm. all that. And uh, it just came second nature. Right. So it's just, and so like you can basically take how you feel on the inside on any given day and 45 minutes to an hour later, there's something tangible that the world can witness that came from inside. That's just like a great, it's just a great thing. Like and I'll, I'll, the more I think about it, I'd be like, man, I don't know that I'll ever stop doing music like i'll probably be 95 rapping right <laughs> in my box because it's just it's just a form of expression that i don't think i'll ever grow tired of yeah like you know what i'm saying something that i totally love i agree let me ask you this because we're gonna get into um one of you know everybody well everybody's favorite uh part of the show can we get some transition music here uh conclusion can i get some transition hey 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 but da -da 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 the cook up. What is the cook up? The cook up is where we like to come down and not yet. Where we like to come and just create some original dope music. I usually bring my boy YDB in here. He'll cook up a beat, um, and then we'll start to lay down some lyrics. And then every day, we'll you know we have new songs, artwork, the whole thing. It's a whole. You, you've seen a couple episodes. You know what we do. Yeah. That's so, the same. but I wanted to ask you this. I know you specialize in house, right? Yeah. And I know that house music is a vibe for people to dance to. And Absolutely. just co correct me when I stop telling the truth. <laughs> so what does, what can I, because what we're going to do is I'll have him come in here and I'll let you guys produce the beat together. I've never made a, a house beat. I've never performed over a house beat. What vocally happens over house beats? Do people rap over it? Do they just say shit? Like what, because I'm not a huge house music fan. So what could I be doing over the like could I rap over it? Like what are you thinking? Like what are you seeing in the in, in your head? You could do anything over house music. Okay. Okay, cool. Which I, I've almost have heard almost anything. Okay. From rapping, singing, okay, preaching almost pretty much. So anything goes. Got anything it. goes. Okay, so cool. So we'll have fun. We'll put it all together. What I wanna do before we do that is I do this with all of our guests. I like to play a couple of songs from the show that we've done before, just so you can kind of just get, a, you know, to hear some of the different vibes. I usually pick three. You guys can start putting your uh, your your request in the uh, in the chat. You um, guys know the rules in the chat. the chat. If you put up a, a request, you know, drop a comment. Your request might be uh, taken into consideration. If you want that to be a demand, drop that super chat, and we'll make sure whatever your request is that we put it in either the beat or the lyrics and you'll get that done. All right. So first song I want to I want to put up. I think everybody kind of wants to hear. Oh, you know what? You didn't put it in there, did you? B A N. Yeah. And y'all put it in already. 
podcast. <laughs> Good podcasting. Um, I moved everything around, so it's just going to be. No, let me get to this one. Here we go. Oh, like the notification? Alright. And let me grab the song from Mr. B. B-A-N. Okay, so this is the song that we did Friday with my good friend Patrick Cloud from All Deaf Digital. Shout out to Patrick Cloud. And uh, it's called uh, B-A-N. It was an acronym for Bitch Ass Nigga. nigga. <laughs> Let's go. Hold on a second. You can woo-wee. Shut up. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and here we go. You want to throw out the artwork? You yes, can. sir. The- like the revenge of the donuts like usually donuts are in you <laughs> no you're yeah, in a donut, donut. <laughs> I don't need no praise, better pay cash Make another page with your fake ass I've been dodging strays, you a straight cat Candy coated pain on the Eminem Maybach Shouldn't even say that I don't say jack Spent a fortune on my wheels, past say jack I had to spin the block on it cause the ass way fat Yo bitch over here, I did not okay that yeah. Shouldn't have to tell you homie, I don't play that I keep saying a hundred million, I'm about to make that A visualization, they told me it was hallucination But it ain't though, keep saying that all the way to the bank though Trust me, I know what it is and what it ain't though I'm dropping music every day, them niggas got the same flow No matter what these niggas do, it just ain't dope Me and Patrick drop a hat trick on you lame hoe yeah. This time I'm jumping out the window with it This time ain't rented, if you want it, then go get it I can see through the fuck shit, even if them windows tinted You forget those winning until you hear that flow I took a ball off to make you miss that shit Everything I said, trust me, I did that shit And everything that I'ma do, you won't forget that shit Y'all some bitch ass niggas Lie about the bitch ass nigga Never on shit ass nigga Fuck it Y'all some bitch ass niggas Lie about the bitch ass nigga Never on shit ass nigga Fuck it It is the morning cup of dough The number one morning show Let's go buy the yacht dough next. Never on a shit ass nigga. Sneak and take a big ass nigga. And none of them are with my niggas. None. Nigga. Nigga. (laughs) Let's go buy the yacht. Here we go. Yes, sir. Weekend though. I came to get paid, fuck the games My team is solid, nigga, fuck the lanes I keep my space in my own lane Nigga, I don't play, I am high octane Not me, I can hide with the fame I'm Basquiat, put the art in frames I'm a grown ass man, nigga, stop the game I stop the game, clip, pop the bang right. Roman weed, the nigga getting high Stacking money, ain't just getting by Cross T and I dot J. That's why they call me D O B O Y. I'm trying to get it, ain't got time for talking. No direct deposit, why we talking? I don't want the bitch, why we talking? I'm the king of this, why we talking? I came from the bottom of the roads. Found me like this when it put me on. Ripping Sacramento City till I'm gone. It's empty, so I'm checking for the throne. Don't play, I am ass to the bone. Let's go, James and Alvin. I pray for the days I was on. Now these are the days that I'm on. Let's go. I see you, Boma. Let's go. 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 Why did we talk to him? I'm walking around with my new bitch. She told me let's go to the mall. I'm smoking on nothing but loose leaves. I'm fucking on nothing but strong. These niggas be claiming they street smart. I'm testing it out on their job. These niggas be claiming they big heart. But really, these niggas is soft. I done got money with all of my niggas. I done got love for none of these hoes. I'm walking around with a knot full of O's. I'm walking around with a pop full of gold. I'm walking around like an expedition. She give me top of the new Rango. The rookie car say me condition. You know I had to slay that hoe. Jay Morris got the fucking rhythm. Dope boy understood the mission. Big blunts like I'm smoking buildings. Big butt like a television. She on my dick, she got tunnel vision. I told her, hold it, she can cuddle with it. I told her I'm the coldest in the building. Big cuz like your uncle children. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's this, go. This song got a couple of changes at the end, though, that I love. Let's go. Shout out to 
Shout out to Jay Morris on the beat. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Where are we going next? Let's go. Let's go. Jameson Flow. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Did you hear me? Let's go. Yes, sir. Let's go. Let's go. We're going on a journey. Let's go. Let's go. What up, Ray? Let's go. Let's go. Forgot all about the switch up. Nigga, this shit is crazy. I forgot. Like, this is two and one. Three and one. Three. You, ain't, you forgot about everything. Back to back to back. Trey P. Only getting started. It's the morning cup of dough. It's the cook up. Click that like button. To stop being a custer. Uh, let's go back to my way. Let's go back to your crib. Let's go back to your bed. Let's go back to when I can. Actually, let's, let's do uh, think about your mom since Slink is in the building. Let's do think about your mom. Each other's head. She said, let's go have some fun. I'd rather let you go Ooh. instead. Let's go out of town. Okay. Let's go a few rounds. Whatever we do, let's just go right now. I hustle late into the morning. Quit asking me why I keep yawning. I'm just so tired of being. Where I am right now They can't hold me down But they gon' keep trying And they gon' keep lying I'ma keep testifying Let's go to the success Let go of BS and let go of stress I know, you know That we gon' be just fine Let's go Let's go Let's go I feel real melancholy today, but I turn up. That's what Big Bro said. Look, I'ma come like this. Look, I cannot afford this housekeeping. I got Black Jesus on the couch sleeping, and he won't wake up. Look, Black Jesus. Look, uh, motion picture type vibes at this current time. Fat Drake in the future, what a time to be alive. Studio owner, that's on my resume. Curated the bomb and it's been to detonate. Kaboom and smoke fills up the room. I get in and get out. I figured it out. I'ma touch a hundred million after taxes. Is there been a bracket Ooh. for that? I don't care though. I don't even mess with these niggas. Most of them weirdo. weirdos. New nickname alert. My mind clear though. I got a rare flow. I'm out of my mind. Since 79, I was destined to shine. Stay on my grind from the morning to the nighttime. Learned early on there's no such thing as the right time. So do it right now, not now, right now. And if you hating on a nigga, you should pipe down, nigga. Yo, sometimes I be thinking of your mind. Sometimes I be thinking of your mom. Sometimes I be thinking of your mom. Your mom is on my mind one time. Your mom is on my mind one time. I be thinking of your mom. I be thinking of your mom. I'm the greatest and most creative. Bitches try to come through with wild shit accusations and I fade them. You can ask my nigga why DB. The bitches wanna come through and ride on me like the uh -huh. slimy rocket express. Jeez. I take him through the clouds in the stratosphere in a sundress and hit that little booty hole. Slink knows your motherfucking bitches got the duty rolls. You better do your duty. I wanna come through and rub lotion on your booty. I'm the magnificent, super tall, gripping, gripping shit. And I'm gripping shit. You can ask my young nigger, and I know his mom, but I had, I didn't even take her ass to the after prom. Living my Jeff life, living my best life. I might come through and fuck on your best wife. Sometimes I be thinking of your mom. Sometimes I be thinking of your mom. Sometimes I be thinking of your mom. Your mom is on my mind one time. Your mom is on my mind one time. I be thinking of your mom. 
got me thinking of your mom Sometimes slings love profanity I like to express myself this way Don't be mad at me People call it vanity But all they call it insanity In the L.A. County Court In the L.A. County Jail System I don't want to cuss no more But when I diss them I gotta let them know how I feel And sometimes four letter words Are the best appeal I'm the best and I come through and I like to feel on your mom's breast She's always impressed when I come through and I show her my girth She says, Slink, how much is that worth? I, I said, said a, a whole, whole lot. lot She says, Slink, can I put it in my box? I, I said, of course not, not. You, you don't, don't even deserve. deserve You fuck with me, you be fucking, fucking with these nerds. nerds Sometimes I be thinking of your mom Sometimes I be thinking of your mom Sometimes I be thinking of your mom your mom is on my mind one time Your mom is on my mind one time I be thinking of your mom I be thinking of your mom So, um, right off the rip, we had a couple of ideas before we, we jumped in here and started the episode. Um, what was the name of the song that we were going to... Uh, Flip. Flip. Yeah, I want to do that. I think that's a good idea. I know that we weren't necessarily going to sample it, but I want to actually incorporate elements of the actual song into the beat, even though we're like technically like you're like flipping the the like premise lyric. of the song. Yeah, the lyric. So what was the name of the song? I forgot. I forgot. To... Girl I House. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what it was. Girl I House. house. Girl I House. Jungle Brothers. Jungle Brothers. So shout out Jungle Brothers. Facts, Native Tongues, all that. Right, right. I have no idea who they are. I was born in '95, guys. Okay, uh, they were we get it. You're me. young. You never heard of like De La, Das Effects, all them. Bunks, diggity, bunks, diggity, bunks, huh? So I watch a pop, rum, bum, 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 while I can feed five your four. Biggity, bo, here a pop of. What do you say? A Peter Piper. I'm hyper than Pinocchio's nose because I could, because I'm a super, I'm a super califragilistic hip hop pro. I gave a whoopsie. Daisy, now you got me crazy. Crazy with the whoops, boogity boo, rest the gravy. So one, two, uh, unbuckle uh, my um, shoe, yabba do, hibbity hoo, gaggle poo, so dig a tree, chicken treat. Grab a seat. Yo, I took it. That's just, I haven't heard Man, it. Man, yeah. Dr. Seuss rhymes. Mm -hmm. Nigga, that's Dawson Facts, nigga. Like, nigga I'm, it was hard. I'm just. <laughs> oh, man. The diggity diggity. Um. So, off rip, what I want to do is this. I want to, like, I want to get the rhythm because I want to get the, like, te the tempo and the rhythm and, like, the bounce of it. Mm -hmm. And then um, incorporate the sample and then let you let you cook, let you do you. Or how do you want to do it? Like, what do you think? Oh, I just heard you. Did you play on that last record? Yeah. I know you can play. So I, I play, I play, I play. Yeah, I play really well. Let's do the reverse. I'll do okay, that. That, that works for me. You play on top. Okay. Um, are you familiar with FL Studio? Ah, we do not have logic on the computer. Well, then you'll do the beat. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you feel like rapping today? You can rap with me. I'm going to be rapping. What are we going to be talking about? Hoes? I'm sure. Uh, no, why did you beat no, the yeah, set it up? To you don't have to. I, I, I can set it up to where you could still, you know what I'm saying? Do your thing. thing. Yeah, 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 yeah. And he'll just help you. Yeah, think. yeah don't trip. I got you on the hook. Whatever you want to do. That's right. That's right. I'm with whatever. All yeah. Right. Just stop. I'm just trying touch. not to be aggravated because I ain't smoking today. So. This is hard. Drink some water. Yeah, this has been. Um, well, I guess I could talk about this too while you guys are doing that. Um, I'm currently doing. Uh, uh, <laughs> uh huh. Go I don't ahead. even know if I want to say this. I don't want to deal with the ridicule. Go ahead and get ridiculed. It's fine. So, guys, at the um, in the chat, I'll talk to you while he starts the beat. I'm not distracting you, am I? I'll are let you? you know if you are. I'll beat your ass. Shut up. <laughs> I'll let you know. No, you won't tell me no shit. Um, anyway. Um, so, all right. Can I be vulnerable, chat? Y'all want vulnerable, though, or y'all want funny hijinks and hilarity? Because you can have whatever you like. Pause. You Crazy. Like. Can we stop doing that, please? Yeah, yeah. yeah Thank I you. got you. Uh, second time. Uh-oh. <laughs> uh -oh. Remember not to play Take too much. Off. JB's y'all. Yeah. JB's y'all. Check this out. Girl out house shoot. Girl out house. Alright. Okay, this is okay, this is the only thing that I'm thinking about, right? We must be careful. I'm listening. 
because if we rip too much of it, we'll just simply be struck. Okay, so th this was my whole idea from. So I just don't want us that. to be married to having to do that. If we we're not going to take the um, that part of where we're going to interpolate, we're going to interpolate over a different part of the beat, over a different part of the song, and I'm just going to chop a little bit of it. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'm gonna build the watch. I mean, I've never questioned. You. I'm just saying, just keep in mind copyright infringements. Of course, I've been making this beat in my head all morning. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's, How, it's funny. It's already like low key made in my. Head. <laughs> you, when you cut your mustache off, did it feel like your lip lost thirty pounds? <laughs> you know what I do? You know what I do when I cut my mustache? No. What do you do? I go through the different phases of beards. Like I, 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 I don't feel like you can grow a, a full beard. I couldn't grow. Yeah, a I can. You've never seen me with a beard? No. Yeah, I can. You look like a deer. <laughs> you really do. You look like oh Bambi in the face. Yeah, it look like you from Planet of the Apes. Like you know this. Yeah. Jesus, I know that probably sounded racist, have, but I'm black, no. so it's cool. I have a very prominent <laughs> upper lip, nigga. That's crazy. Yeah, that joint is out there. It's further than you know. You yeah, monkey it's mouth. <laughs> I look like a Simpsons character. You do. <laughs> you got the Simpsons. You look like Nelson. <laughs> uh, I look like Homer when he was a kid. There's pictures of Homer when he was a kid? Yeah. I've never seen Homer when he was a kid. Oh, I'm pull, wow. Pull it up. I'm going to pull it up Jay right Mars now. Jay said he looked like a snitch. <laughs> yeah, that's wild. Oh, he looked like a... Hilarious. <laughs> he like Yo, a pull up pull up, young Homer Simpson, uh, okay. YDB, I mean, Yo, Clue, yeah, and I pull you. that shit up. I want to make that into like an album art if we can. That'll be hilarious. That's funny. Yeah. Anyway. I could definitely uh, work my magic. Yeah. Oh, yeah. JB's, y'all. Yeah. I can't put it when the producer tag is in there. That's wild. Wonder which one. That's what I'm gonna just click. I'm gonna put, watch this. It's not. That's not the one. All right, so I'm gonna talk about this because I feel like I'm about to break it. So I'm about to talk now. That's kind of hard. All right, so does the audience want to hear about my vulnerability moments? Y'all want to hear vulnerability? They said, yeah, they said vulnerable. All right, all right, let me let me lay this down. Tempo should we be at? Man, I would say one thirty. One thirty. To get that like bounce. Mm -hmm. I'm about to be rapping, rapping. Yeah. Like that. You got them lungs. You good. I got them. You good. I'm about to build this shit. All right, so guys, here I'm gonna tell you what's going on, just in case you want to know. I had an epiphany, a moment of clarity, if you will, mm -hmm. over the weekend. <laughs> That was wild. Yeah, that's <laughs> that was wild. perfect timing, though. I'm so hungry. Okay. <sighs> okay. Uh <-huh>. So <laughs> I can't even think. All right. So I have. You can you can go ahead and make the beat. I'm just gonna oh, talk. I'm making the beat. Okay. So hmm. I had an epiphany too fast. Whoa. I don't need. Sorry. I don't I need the likes say, of you. Whoa! I just it just. And why does it look? What up? are we? <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> Little dirty stash, buddy. <laughs> IDB. That's me. <laughs> is there really that long of a delay? Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah it really is. The delay is really lo uh, laggy today. It's in the wrong place. All right, so guys. 
feel like don't nobody give a damn. I ain't saying it. Be vulnerable, though. We're here for it. So, <laughs> yeah, I t- I'm going to stand in my truth. Oh, that's hard. They said those bed squeaks are fire. Why does this keep doing this? Why does it keep going and saying... I don't know why it does that. No, not that. What was what it was doing on the screen? Did you see what it was doing on the screen? It, it kept saying, like, countdown, 29, 28. I'm like, I don't count down. It, it's, it's, I don't know, something's going on with the, it's like a glitch today with the system, but, um, yeah, it's to, like we, not clicking the button. We need to unglitch that, Bobak. Anyway, so, I'm fasting, y'all, water fasting. Today. Tomorrow. And 38 days after that. 40 day water fast. Listen, I don't. <laughs> I just need to get. Okay. Nigga, that's crazy. No, 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 no. <laughs> You're in that baggie, huh? You feel me, New York Calm? Just for 40 days and 40 nights, man. Just, I'll be chasing these women too much. <laughs> you know, I, I, I feel like I got an unhealthy relationship with food. I want to stop smoking. So we just going to... But I can only do it one day at a time, so... Ooh. Starting the day. Nigga! With the blick in there. In, 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 instead of running him over an ice Oops, cream truck, you're running him over an ambulance. That's so okay. macabre. Right. As I was saying it, I just realized how macabre was good. I like this beat already. <laughs> DB said, have I, try, have I done that before? No. I've tried. I just had, listen, man. I'm one of them people, man. When I get something in my mind, I'm just, mm-hmm. it's probably just better to just tell me how to do it than to try to talk me out of it. <laughs> I don't know what's on the other side of a 40-day water fast, but we're going to find out. But I'm only focusing on getting through today. You know? Wow, look at that. He said he smoked while fasting for 30 days and lost 50 pounds of pure fat. Best decision I ever made in my life. Good luck to you. Shout out to Brandon J. Singh. That's what I needed to hear. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, it can be done. Talked about that earlier. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Charlie Funk, I'm going to hit you live. It's lit. I love this support, guys. I'm going to do this. This is day one. I'm going to have fun over this one.
my first time ever doing a house anything. I should be late. I'm gonna let y'all cook for a minute. I'm gonna take five.
Oh, wow. Okay. Okay. I'm fucking with this. It's hard. I'm about to be rapping some old ridiculous shit over this. I love this. Where you happy to be, man? How you feeling about it so far? Me? Uh, yeah, producer. Uh, half of the show that know. offers commentary. Um, yeah, so far, I feel good. I just feel like it needs some melodic elements. I've been doing mostly drum stuff so far. Okay. So we'll figure out the like what type of melodies to put to it. Although it's it doesn't need to be like super melodic. It just needs to have enough. Do button. house beats this is for 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 you, uh, Blizzy. Do house beats normally have a lot of melodies and stuff? Or not a ton? Uh, it depends on the genre. Okay. There's like deep house, that's where you get all your soul for it sounds like gospel almost in soul records. Oh wow, okay. You know, like techno stuff it just sounds and hard, gotcha. hard hits and stuff like that. E D M too. Electronic. <laughs> You can finish what you was No, no, no. I'm, I'm just out of something. Uh, you got break beats. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. There you go. Where? Um, where, you think it, where you think we should put the... the that'll the, come in like when the song is full. It could be like, because it's like the, the meat of the song. With the... Literally like exactly what you sound like. That, I, I got it right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but it's a different part. It's this part right here. It's where the song's like. Kind of gangster. Niggas bringing the, the blick to the house party. Wow, that's hard. That's crazy. <laughs> Let's go, YDB, you fucking genius. Oh, that's gonna be one of them ones. Ha, 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 ha. 
Why do I feel like YDB has been waiting to make this beat his whole life? <laughs> I think he's now a, a house producer. <laughs> oh, I've been a house producer, bro. You said what? I've been a house producer. I'm actually a DJ. You've never played me in any house beats? It's because I lost my turntables. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm going to get some back eventually. But... How do you lose turntables? Okay, so they were in my car, and my car got impounded, and I lost that car. That's how you lose. Turn. That's how you lose the turn. <laughs> Bees like that sometimes. How'd you lose your mustache? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> it was very painful. This type of music is a lot about subverting expectations. What does subverting mean? Subverting expectations is doing the opposite of what people think you're going to do. Ah. So let's find another That was for the people at home. Of course, I knew what that meant. <laughs> Old house music be so fire. <laughs> <laughs> It'd be such a specific flavor of like... This isn't, I wouldn't even consider this house though. I would consider this more like apartment. Nah, nah, nah. This Condo. Is more like, uh, this is. Laugh at my joke that I made about houses. This is almost disco, dog. <laughs> like, it'll be. But it has the elements of what house music is. But that's what, they call, that's what they call house music. It's like 90s, 80s, and 90s. Yeah, disco, facts, you're right. So. Yep, pretty much. Feels up and ungenerous, I'm in your face. You gotta sample them? Is that too much? Oh, hey. Feel the vibe. Feel the bass. Come on. I let you cook. I've learned this a lot. Feel the vibe. Feel the vibe. Feel the bass. Come on. Mm. Feel the vibe. Feel, feel the vibe. Feel the vibe. Feel the vibe. Feel the vibe. Feel the bass. Come on. Feel the vibe. Feel the vibe. Feel the bass. Come on. Feel the vibe, feel the vibe, feel the bass. Come on. Feel the vibe, feel. <laughs> What's going feel on the vibe, here? Feel the vibe, feel the bass. Come on. Feel the vibe. Actually, that's not perfect. Yeah. Come on, man. Come on, man. I, I hear you. I hear you, man. Sheesh. I think I pitched it up by two. No, I think you pitched it up by two. Yeah, it was two. What did we do that? Hey, man. Ever since he cut that mustache off, he's been a different guy. <laughs> we weren't getting this type of productivity out of him last week. Uh, Believe also, you me. <laughs> That's the post porn. Oh, yeah. For sure. I quit porn, cut off the <laughs> Yeah, I quit filming porn. <laughs> feel the vibe. Feel the vibe. Feel the bass. Come on. Feel the vibe. Feel the vibe. Feel the bass. Come on. Feel the vibe. Okay, feel the vibe. Feel the bass. Feel the vibe. Feel the vibe. Feel the bass. Come on. Feel the vibe. Feel the vibe. Feel the bass. Come on. Hmm. 
They said it feels like you could make a whole movie around this vibe, like a black n- rock, <laughs> the night at the black Roxbury. <laughs> That's funny. Right? Right. That's funny. The night at the black Roxbury. That's hilarious. Ah. This didn't exist 30 minutes ago. That's crazy. Not at all. <laughs> Prepared.
the vibe, feel the vibe, feel the bass, come on. Feel the vibe, feel the vibe, feel the bass, come on. Feel the vibe, feel the vibe, feel the bass, come on. Feel the vibe, feel the vibe, feel the bass, come on. So is it gonna end like that with the, what you just did? Okay, cool. I love it. Round of applause. Are you done? Round of applause for YDB. Round of applause for, for Bizzle. And now we're finna cook. That's crazy. Y'all did that pretty fast, man. Well, we're in a different lane now. All right, well, now I'm gonna have to try to figure out how to say words. Techno rap it? I'll figure it out. Got a uh, jump in your old school bag, jump in your Africa Bam bag. Whoa. Whoa. Hey, none of that. No, 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 no. no. I just, I'm just not an Africa nah, Bam Bada fan. If, uh, Planet Rock? Uh, I'm not a huge fan of Planet Africa Bam Rock. I mean, that one song. Nah. He got some tracks, bro. I'm not the biggest fan of that song. No. That's what I'm saying. Like, I'm, that's what I'm, I mean, I'm, I'm not, not even a huge a fan song. of that. That's what I'm saying. Like, I don't really feel but like he was. Like... And it's not no hate, but it's just like, I don't. I don't remember a bunch of Afri Africa Bambada music you know, I feel back that. in my day. So it ain't like I'm hating. So, uh, shout out to Africa Bambada. <laughs> <laughs> uh, here we go. So you want to, you want to, uh, let me hear this again. And you want to grab the other mic, uh, Whitey Bizzle? Bizzle. I'll bring it in. Don't okay. I got you. And then I'm thinking what I could do is I'll just rap, say what I want to say rap wise, and then if you want to figure out what you want, or unless you want to lay the hook first, what you want to do? How you feel? You tell me. I feel like let me just rap. Let me just see what I'm talking about. Yeah. Yeah. And then we can go from there. Thank you, sir. Oh, but just think in terms of the hook. About fucking these hoes? Yep. All right. I'll be fucking these hoes. <laughs> well, Use your vice to your Use advantage. your vice to your advantage. Huh? Was that, was that uh, the fourth? Huh? My headphones that came out a little bit. Check, check. So I'm talking about smashing chicks. That's what that's the that's the vibe? <laughs> that's the vibe. Pussy. Can you have me that that water? <laughs> Come on, chat. Come on, chat. What it do? Oh, okay, Charlie Funk. Shout outs to the Zulu Nation, my boy Phoenix Orion and the whole Zulu Nation. Feel me? Shout out them guys. Facts. Is the mic on? Oh. My boy L Scatterbrain. Give it a sec. All my Zulu Nation homies. Alright, now I just want to be on the record for saying I've never done this. I don't I'm... need judgment. You say that a lot? Shut your face up. <laughs> I'm just so how we do this here is we just punch one line at a time. So yeah. Yep. I'm just trying to come up with that first line. Got you. Check, check, check. Uh and what was the hook sounding like? It was saying, fuck these hoes. What was it saying? Girl, I'll fuck you. Girl, I'll, I'll fuck, fuck you. <laughs> Jesus. Girl, I'll fuck you. You in my house now. Oh, that, okay. <laughs> All right, let me hear it. Let me, uh. One second, sir. So, fun fact. There was a, a, a preview for a movie. This is what I want to say. This is the point of what I'm trying to say. The preview for your movie will make people either want to watch it or not want to watch it. So there was a preview to a movie that came out. And I was when I seen the preview, I was just like, eh, whatever. Like maybe I'll watch it on video. That's how I felt about video. it. Video, right? Then I seen a documentary, eleven minute documentary this morning about the family that the movie was about. And watching that documentary has me like, I have to go watch that wow. movie tonight. It was about, have you heard of that? It's about wrestling. Have you heard of the Iron Claw family? Mm. Oh, I know what yeah. you're talking about. Yo, that Clue shit. Have you heard about that? that? Yeah, I'm Clue a super, super fan. Of Yo, of that, that uh, shit is wild. The Texas tornado, that was Yo, my guy. Yo, this dude had like seven sons, like, and some, I don't even want to give it away to people who haven't, who don't. It's a movie called the, Iron the Von Claw. Erics, the Von Erichs, the Von Erich family. Iron Claw. Wow. So I don't want to give away what I know about it. But do yourself, because I'm going to go watch the movie so tonight. I'll break down the, the no, known. No, tell them. No, the known, the known facts. Oh, no, because so, you might give away too much. No, I'm not. Okay. So it's the Von Erich family. They're uh, a traditional 
family and a huge family in the wrestling community. Their father started um, a wrestling business and also a training camp in Texas. And he was really famous for his training camp, same as like the Hart family in Canada. Um, so yeah, pretty much his, yeah, his brother, his sons blew up pretty fast and, and there was a lot of tragedies, a whole lot of tragedies within their family. And the story is super compelling. They, they wrestled from Texas to Japan to making it on WWF formerly or formerly WWF now WWE. But yeah, their story is amazing. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna go watch that movie tonight. I'm gonna order it. It's amazing. And that was just, but that's just the the point. The main point I was trying to make was, I probably would have been way more excited to watch that movie had they added more stuff about what really happened in the trailer. I would have been like, absolutely, sign me up for this. But they didn't. Wow. Yeah. Uh, well, good. it's kind of a known. Their family is known if you're in that niche of. Well, I wanted fandom. to watch the movie anyway because old boy from Shameless is in there and um. Zach. Yeah, Zach whatever. Efron. Is that his name? High School Musical. Yeah, Zach, Zach no, 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 dude from um Shameless. The older guy. The older guy. Oh, yeah. uh, Kevin Bacon. Wow. Nigga, no. I don't know his name. I don't. Why I don't would Kevin Bacon, Bacon, Bacon be in that movie as a wrestler? <laughs> Kevin Bacon is like sixty-five. What the fuck would he be doing wrestling <laughs> as a young 20-year-old male? The funny thing, about, I've never seen Shameless. I just know that Kevin Bacon's in it. No, he's not. <laughs> he's not? No. He's what the fuck's wrong with you? Uh, Are you hungry? You just want some bacon, motherfucker? <laughs> no. So the dude was in, and he was also in Bear Creek Diner. You know him. I know, I know you're talking about, uh, 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 what's his name? He has uh, that very distinct look. His name is. He uh, always Mark, looks Aaron, like he needs Aaron, to. Aaron Taylor Johnson. I don't know if that's his name. He always looks know. like he needs to straighten up. He always looks disheveled. Yeah. You he know was, what I mean. He was in Fargo, too. I'd have never seen Fargo. Hold on. Ah, Let Fargo me pull up. You one. know the guy. Don't do this. Oh, I don't know his man. name. Nah, now, see, now we got to make it a whole thing. No, it's a thing. Hold on one second. Shame this. And rest in peace to uh, everyone, the Von Eric family. And uh, rest in peace, TC Islam. Speaking of Zulu Nation. See, why would you give away sp spoilers? Nobody knew anybody died. No, I'm not saying <laughs> Jesus. I bow, clearly bow, said bow, don't bow, give away bow. any of the spoilers. And nigga says rest in peace to him. Nigga, that's clearly a spoiler. I mean if he's I didn't say who. But if I okay. I know. Okay. If I clearly say don't give away any spoilers, and the nigga two minutes later No, his name is Jeremy Allen White. Oh, that guy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so you know, like he always has that like disheveled look like wake up, nigga. Yeah. He always has like that Jay <laughs> Cutler like, look up. to him. <laughs> you know how Jay Cutler always looked like he was fresh off a of sig? Like, <laughs> nigga, go play quarterback. What are you doing? So that's how he always looks. Like he just but there's a look for that. Disheveled. All right, let's go. Run from the top. Let me see what I can put together word wise. Yeah. Oh. So how do you hear this hook going, just so I can hear how you hear it? And you know that I came to get a. I'm in the house where the hoes at. I came to get a cracking when you know it. I'm in the house where the hoes at. I came to get a cracking and you know that. Show that. <laughs> where the hoes at. I came to get a cracking when you know that. That's up. They're running from the front. Okay. 
Keep it a hundred, I ain't never rapped on a house beat. But I done snuck the blick in a house party, but uh, we ain't really gonna go down that path. I mean, I see a lot of beautiful young ladies in the building tonight. I'm just trying to see who's trying to fuck. You can keep that. Let me let me let me do that off. Let me do that. Let me do that. I can get it back from that. Ah! Uh, I just I ain't never rapped over no house beat, so. But I have snuck the blick in the house party before. But that's neither here nor there. We're all the hoes that's trying to fuck. Yeah, I hear that. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, uh, I just, I ain't never rapped over no house beat, so, but I have snuck the blick in the house party before, but that's neither here nor there. We're all the hoes that's trying to fuck. Let's do it. Ah, uh, I just, I ain't never rapped over no house beat, so. But I have snuck the blick in the house party before, but that's neither here nor there. We're all the hoes that's trying to fuck. Uh, I'm in the house where the hoes at. I can't get it cracking, and you know that. All right, let's go to the next line. I got it. I'm in the house where the hoes at. I can't even get it cracking and you know that. Little mama got ass, just show that. You get it back. Little mama got ass, show that. I'm in the house where the hoes at. I can't even get it cracking and you know that. Little mama got ass, just show that. Let me get it back. Go to show that. I'm in the house where the hoes at. I can't even get it cracking and you know that. Little mama got ass, don't show that. Oh, let's get back. Let me, let me do it over. <clears throat> I'm in the house where the hoes at. I can't even get it cracking and you know that. She got hella ass. She should show that. Show that. One more time. She got hella ass. She gonna show that. I'm in the house where the hoes at. I can't even get it cracking and you know that. She got hella ass. She gonna show that. Let me hear it. Uh, I just, I ain't never rapped over no house beat, so, but I have snuck the blick in the house party before, but that's neither here nor there. We're all the hoes that's trying to uh, I'm in the house where the hoes at, I can't even get it cracking and you know that. She got hella ass, she gon' show that. Let me hear it back. Sit away, man. Ah! Uh, I just. I ain't never rapped over no house beat, so. But I have snuck the blick in the house party before, but that's neither here nor there. We're all the hoes that's trying to. Ah! Uh, I'm in the house where the hoes at. I can't even get it cracking and you know that. She got hella ass, she gon' show that. Alright, do it. I'm in the house where the hoes at. I can't even get it cracking and you know that. She got hella ass. She gon' show that. She been waiting all night just to throw it back. Let's go. Next line. She got hella ass. She gon' show that. She been waiting all night just to throw it back. Oh, one more. Can you take it back a little bit further? I can't even get it cracking and you know that. She got hella ass. She gon' show that. She been waiting all night just to throw it back. I lost it. Shit. Let me hear it back from the top. Ah! Uh, I just. I ain't never rapped over no house beat, so. But I have snuck the blick in the house party before, but that's neither here nor there. We're all the hoes that's trying to. Uh, I'm in the house where the hoes at. I can't even get it cracking and you know that. She got hella ass. She gon' show that. She been waiting all night just to throw it back. I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that. Let's go. I'm a real, and I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that. I can't even get it cracking and you know that. She got hella ass, she gon' show that. She been waiting all night just to throw it back. 
damn it, why do I keep forgetting every time I... Hold on, hold on. Oh, yeah. I can't even get it cracking if you know that. She got hella ass, she gon' show that. She been waiting all night just to throw it back. And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that. I'm in the house for the hoes at. I can't even get it cracking if you know that. She got hella ass, she gon' show that. She been waiting all night just to throw it back. And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that. I hear that from the top, from the top. I'm from the top, please. Ah, uh, I just, I ain't never rapped over no house beat, so, but I have snuck the blick in the house party before. But that's neither here nor there. We're all the hoes that's trying to. Uh, I'm in the house where the hoes at. I can't even get it cracking if you know that. She got hella ass, she gon' show that. She been waiting all night just to throw it back. And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that. Start it back on top. Ah, uh, I just I ain't never rapped over no house beat so, but I have snuck the blick in the house party before. But that's neither here nor there. We're all the hoes that's trying to. Uh, I'm in the house where the hoes at. I can't even get it cracking if you know that. She got hella ass. She gon' show that. She been waiting all night just to throw it back. And I'm a real nigga. I'ma catch that. I'm here back. Ah, uh, I just, I ain't never rapped over no house beat so, but I have snuck the blick in the house party before. But that's neither here nor there. We're all the hoes that's trying to. Uh, I'm in the house where the hoes at. I can't even get it cracking if you know that. She got hella ass, she gon' show that. She been waiting all night just to throw it back. And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that. She been waiting all night just to throw it back. And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that. Grab a magnum off the uh. She been waiting all night just to throw it back. And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that. Grab the magnum. Let's go. She been waiting all night just to throw it back. And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that. Grab the magnum. That's that's too many words. Grab the magnum off the dresser, I'ma stretch that. Let me try it. Grab the magnum off the stretcher. Grab the she been waiting all night just to throw it back. And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that. Magnum off the dress, I'ma stress that. Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stress that. Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stress that. Let's go. She been waiting all night just to throw it back. And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that. Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stress that. Nice. What you think, uh, y y DB? I get it? Let me hear it. This is fun, rapping about the hoes and whatnot. <laughs> I never get a chance to kind of go down this path. I'm always talking about I want to get married. Fuck all that. <laughs> yeah, fuck. <laughs> fuck oh, that. Shit. 
I'm in the house where the hoes at I came to get it cracking and you know that She got hella ass, she gon' show that She been waiting all night just to throw it back And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stretch that Let's go And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stretch that And I'm a fat nigga, you ain't expect that <laughs> You'd always be surprised They'd be like, hey, like, yeah, we in here And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stretch that And I'm a fat nigga, you ain't expect that <laughs> I hear back from the top Ah <laughs> <Yeah. Off. laughs> I just I ain't never rapped over no house beat, so. But I have snuck the blick in the house party before. But that's neither here nor there. We're all the hoes that's trying to. I'm in the house where the hoes at. I can't even get it cracking and you know that. She got hella ass, she gon' show that. She been waiting all night just to throw it back. And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that. Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stretch that. And I'm a fat nigga, you ain't expect that. <laughs> Alright, let me hear back, let me hear back one time, one more time. Ah! Uh, I just, I ain't never rapped over no house beat, so, but I have snuck the blick in the house party before, but that's neither here nor there. We're all the hoes that's trying to, oh! Uh, I'm in the house where the hoes at. I came to get it cracking and you know that. She got hella ass, she gon' show that. She been waiting all night just to throw it back. And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that. Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stretch that. And I'm a fat nigga, you ain't expect that. You don't take cash, you got a blesser in the cash app. Ooh, I like that. Put it back, put it back on the top. You don't pick. And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that. Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stretch that. And I'm a fat nigga, you ain't expect that. Don't take cash, bless on the cash. Let's go. You don't take cash, bless. Thank you, DJ Too Loud. And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that. Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stretch that. And I'm a fat nigga, you ain't expect that. She don't take cash. <clears throat> she don't take. Oh wait, that's cash twice. I don't know if that works. And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that. Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stretch that. And I'm a fat nigga, you ain't expect that. She ain't taking no singles. Get the cash <clears throat> out. Yeah. There you go. That did the work. Singles was dope. Yeah. <laughs> I like I just the flip. Out there. <laughs> yeah. YDB, they want to know, are you hopping on this too? It's a solo mission. Nigga, why did you just do that? You got to see the camera. <laughs> You're wild. Why do you drink like that? That wasn't even a pause, but that was just like, why do you drink out of a straw? Like, did you see yourself? Do you normally do that? <laughs> Fail. <laughs> watch, watch what's going to happen when he drinks. Look, look at yourself. Watch, watch yeah. yourself and how you drink out of this. Hold up, watch when you do this, because we got a, a hell of a delay. Watch this. I was like, fam. <laughs> <laughs> you want to talk? Watch, watch, watch. Here we go. <laughs> this is a hell of a delay. You guys got to just fast forward it. It's fine. Uh, oh, I didn't, and you've been oh, out of frame, so you yeah. couldn't even see how ridiculous <laughs> you were. Yeah, he yeah you were ridiculous. It's all good. Yeah. All right, let's hear it. Let's hear it. But Dizzle, please do try to stay in frame. Ah! Uh, I just... Thank you, sir. I ain't never rapped over no house beat, so... But I have snuck the blick in the house party before. But that's neither here nor there. We're all the hoes that's trying to... Uh, I'm in the house where the hoes at. I can't even get it cracking and you know that. She got hella ass, she gon' show that. She been waiting all night just to throw it back. And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that. Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stretch that. And I'm a fat nigga, you ain't expect that. She ain't taking no singles, hit the cash app. Let me get it cleaner. She ain't taking no singles, hit the cash app. Let me get, let me get that a little bit cleaner. And I'm a fat nigga, you ain't expect Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stretch that. And I'm a fat nigga, you ain't expect that. She ain't expect Wait, what did I say?
She ain't taking no singles. Hit the cash app. All right. She ain't taking no singles. Hit the cash app. Get the magnum off the dress. I'ma stress that. And I'm a fat nigga. You ain't expect that. She ain't taking no singles. Hit the cash app. Yeah, record that. I'm in the house where the hoes at I can't even get a crack and then you know that She got hella ass, she gon' show that She been waiting all night just to throw it back And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stretch that And I'm a fat nigga, you ain't expect that She ain't taking no singles, hit the cash app I'm in the house where the hoes at. I can't even get a crack. Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stretch that. And I'm a fat nigga, you ain't expect that. She ain't taking no singles, hit the cash app. Damn it, why is that always hold on? Cash app. Oh yeah. Go ahead, go ahead. Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stretch that. And I'm a fat nigga, you ain't expect that. She ain't taking no singles, hit the cash app. Uh, I know she wanted from the back. Turn around, let me put my stomach on your back. Why? <laughs> <laughs> it said wild. Uh, yeah. <laughs> That's it, though. <laughs> Ladies, you're not living. Until <laughs> Let me see that uh that remote right by you. Thank you. I'm in the house where the hoes at. I can't even get it cracking if you know that. She got hella ass, she gon' show that. She been waiting all night just to throw it back. And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that. Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stretch that. And I'm a fat nigga, you ain't expect that. She ain't taking no singles, hit the cash that. Uh I know she wanted from the back. Turn around, let me put my stomach on your back. <laughs> come on, come on, come on. What the hell? How do I go back? How did this happen? Oh, there we go. There we go. I'm in the house where the hoes at. I can't even get a crack and then you know that. She got hella ass, she gon' show that. She been waiting all night just to throw it back. And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that. Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stretch that. And I'm a fat nigga, you ain't expect that. She ain't taking no singles, hit the cash app. Uh, I know she wanted from the back. Turn around, let me put my stomach on your back. All right, you like that? Ah, uh, I know she wanted from the back. Turn around, let me put my stomach on your back. You like that? Your back. Let's go, let's go. You like that? Ah, uh, I know she wanted from the back. Turn around, let me put my stomach on your back. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You like that? Hold on. <laughs> Johnny Stas, you wild as hell. First of all, why? <laughs> why? This nigga tried to roast me about my bars, about my magnums. <laughs> he said that was... Yo, you good, bro? <laughs> yeah. I've been like shooting out some of my best jokes today. Am I just not funny today? You're making me question myself. You, you gotta I'm... remember, he must shaved his mustache. I'm just like, nigga, are you here? Like, superpowers are I'm like, you laughing? He laughing? I'm like, this nigga won't even smile. I know you just playing Johnny Stas. I'm trying to get this nigga... YDB to <laughs> smile or something, say something, do something. I don't know. All right, come on, let's run it back from the top. Let's run it back from the top. He don't like to smile when he don't have a mustache. Jeez, <laughs> like this guy. You like that? Uh, I know she wanted from the back. Turn around, let me put my stomach on your back. You like that? Oops. Okay. Uh, I know she wanted from the back. Turn around, let me put my stomach on your back. Oh, no, I'm ready. Just my... You like that? Uh, I know she wanted from the back. Turn around, let me put my stomach on your back. You like that? I came in two minutes, but I'm right back. <laughs> uh, Round two, and you. <laughs> let me hear it back from the top. 
I'm in the house for the hoes that I can't. Yeah. Uh, uh. I just. Yeah. I ain't never rapped over no house beat, so. <laughs> but I have snuck the blick in a house party before, but that's neither here nor there. We're all the hoes in front of. Uh, uh. I'm in the house for the hoes that. I can't even get it cracking and you know that She got hella ass, she gon' show that She been waiting all night just to throw it back And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stretch that And I'm a fat nigga, you ain't expect that She ain't taking no singles, hit the cash that Uh, I know she want it from the back Turn around, let me put my stomach on your back You like that? I came in two minutes, but I'm right back Round number two and I'm right Round number two and I'm Round number two and I'm in there Let's go <laughs> wow. You like that? I came in two minutes, but I'm right back. Round two, now I'm all up in there. Get up in your ass just like swimwear. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. Fuck you. You ain't been talking to me all episode anyway, nigga. Don't try to come with me with, with, with uh, rebuttals and critiques now. Nigga been quiet for two hours. I ain't even been here the whole time. Well, you ain't been talking, and I feel... <laughs> I, mean, I ain't no food. I'm supposed to talk to you from another room? Yeah, send me a text and let me know you're thinking. I don't know. Something. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Jeez. Let me hear about it. Let me hear about it. I haven't ate no food all day, nigga. You sit here talking to me. Let me say the things that I want to say on the microphone. <laughs> you like that? I came in two minutes, but I'm right back. Round two. Now I'm all up in there. Get up in your ass just like swimwear. Let me get that back. Get, get up in your ass like swimwear. <laughs> It's ridiculous enough to work. <laughs> I came in two minutes, but I'm right back. Round two and I'm in. I came in two minutes, but I'm right back. Round two and I'm in there. All up in that ass, like swim. All up in that ass, like swimwear. I came in two minutes, but I'm right back. Oops. Go ahead, let's go. I came in two minutes, but I'm right back. Round two and I'm in there. All up in that ass, like swimwear. All up in that ass. All up in that ass, like swimwear. You like that? I came in two minutes, but I'm right back. Round two and I'm in there. Haul up in that ass like swimwear. <laughs> ah! But I have snuck the blick in the house party before, but that's neither here nor there. We're all the hoes in front of. Oh! Uh, I'm in the house for the hoes that. I can't even get it cracking and you know that. She got hella ass, she gon' show that. She been waiting all night just to throw it back. And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that. Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stretch that. And I'm a fat nigga, you ain't expect that. She ain't taking no singles, hit the cash that. Uh, I know she want it from the back. Turn around, let me put my stomach on your back. You like that? I came in two minutes, but I'm right back. Round two and I'm in there. Haul up in that ass like swimwear. <laughs> Come on. Round two and I'm in there. Haul up in that ass like swimwear. Hop right. Round two and I'm in there. Haul up in that ass like swimwear. I pulled the bitch weave out. She got thin hair. <laughs> Shout out to whoever put that in there. Thank you, whoever dropped that to me. That's funny. Round two and I'm in there. Haul up in that ass like swimwear. I pulled the bitch weave out. She got thin hair. I love that from the top. Ah, uh, I just I ain't never rapped over no house beat so, but I have snuck the blick in the house party before. But that's neither here nor there. We're all the hoes in front of. I like this. I'm in the house with a hoes that. I can't even get it cracking and you know that. She got hella ass, she gon' show that. She been waiting all night just to throw it back. And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that. Get the magnum off the your best, I'ma stretch that. And I'm a fat nigga, you ain't expect that. She ain't taking no singles, hit the cash that. Uh, I know she want it from the back. Turn around, let me put my stomach on your back. You like that? I came in two minutes, but I'm right back. Round two and I'm in there. Haul up in that ass like swimwear. I pulled the bitch weave out, she got thin hair. One more line, one more line. Alright. That's a hell of a night. Alright, that's good, that's good. That's a hell of a night. Let's go, let's go, let's go. (laughs) 
Round two and I'm in there. All up in that ass like swimwear. I pulled the bitch weave out. She got thin hair. Oh, one more time, one more time. Got thin hair. Round two and I'm in there. All up in that ass like swimwear. I pulled the bitch weave out. She got thin hair. It was a hell of a night. You should have been there. Oh. All right, let me hear back from top. What do you think? I don't think I should uh, ad lib this at all because I feel like everything's just entirely too busy and ad libbing it would be doing too much. Let me hear back from top. Ah. Uh. I just, I ain't never rapped over no house beat, so, but I have snuck the blick in a house party before, but that's neither here nor there. We're all the hoes in Toronto. Whoa! Uh, I'm in the house where the hoes at. I can't even get it cracking and you know that. She got hella ass, she gon' show that. She been waiting all night just to throw it back. And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that. Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stretch that. And I'm a fat nigga, you ain't expect that. She ain't taking no singles, hit the cash that. Uh, I know she want it from the back. Turn around, let me put my stomach on your back. You like that? I came in two minutes, but I'm right back. <laughs> Round two and I'm in there. All up in that ass like swimwear. I pulled the bitch weave out, she got thin hair. It was a hell of a night, you should've been there. Oh, you can spit on that. Over there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Toronto. Whoa! Uh, I'm in the house where the hoes at. I can't even get it cracking if you know that. She got hella ass. She don't show that. She been waiting all night just to throw it back. And I'm a real nigga. I'm a cash that. Get the magnum off the dress. I'm a cash that. And I'm a fat nigga. You ain't expect that. She ain't taking no singles. Hit the cash that. Uh, I know she wanted from the back. Turn around. Let me put my stomach on your back. You like that? I came in two minutes, but I'm right back. Round two and I'm in there. All up in that ass like swimwear. I pulled the bitch weave out. She got thin hair. It was a hell of a night. You should have been there. I'm ready. Yeah, it was a hell of a night. One, one, two. One, one, two. Check, check. It was a hell of a night, you should've been there. Girl, I'll fuck you. Girl, I'll fuck you. Girl, I'll fuck you. You in my house now. Girl, I'll fuck you. Girl, I'll fuck you. Girl, I'll fuck you. You in my house now. <laughs> One take Jake, huh? Round two and I'm in there. All up in that ass like swimwear. I pulled the bitch weave out. She got thin hair. It was a hell of a night. You should have been there. Girl, I'll fuck you. Girl, I'll fuck you. Girl, I'll fuck you. You in my house now. Girl, I'll fuck you. Girl, I'll fuck you. Girl, I'll fuck you. You in my house now, bitch. Hey, can I get that bitch by itself and then had a deep voice to bridge? Just by itself? Yeah, had, had a bitch fart with the uh, at by itself and do the deep voice shit. Turn it down, pitch it up to the bridge. Oop. Shout outs to everybody tuned in in the chat. Make sure you click that like button. Share this live. Make sure your homies tap in. Make sure your homegirls tap in. Because this is the number one morning show that ain't shot in the morning. And why is that, though? Because niggas wake up late. <laughs> Got better stuff to do than, like, sleep type shit. It was just 2-2-2. Two, two, two. We missed it. We missed it. Oh, y'all don't like our hook? You see what these niggas is talking about? What the hell are y'all talking about? That's it's a crazy world we live in, and we can't just make a fun, 
over no house beat so but I have snuck the blick in a house party before but that's neither here nor there we're all the hoes in front of oh. uh, I'm in the house for the hoes that I can't even get a crack and you know that she got hella ass she don't show that she been waiting all night just to throw it back and I'm a real nigga I'ma catch that get the magnum off the dress I'ma catch that and I'm a fat nigga you ain't expect that she ain't taking no singles hit the cash that uh, I know she want it from the back turn around let me put my stomach on your back you like that? I came in two minutes, but I'm right back. Round two and I'm in there. Haul up in that ass like swimwear. I pulled the bitch weave out. She got thin hair. It was a hell of a night. You should have been there. Girl, I'll fuck you. Girl, I'll fuck you. Girl, I'll fuck you. <laughs> Hold on. Are you straight? Bye, guys. I'm the guy. I, 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 but I have snuck the blick in the house party before. But that's neither here nor there. We're all the hoes in front of Oh, uh, I'm in the house for the hoes that I can't even get it cracking if you know that She got hella ass, she don't show that She been waiting all night just to throw it back And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stretch that And I'm a fat nigga, you ain't expect that She ain't taking no singles, hit the cash that Uh, I know she want it from the back Turn around, let me put my stomach on your back You like that? I came in two minutes, but I'm right back <laughs> Round two and I'm in there Haul up in that ass like swimwear I pulled the bitch weave out, she got thin hair It was a hell of a night, you should've been there Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you You in my house now Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you You in my house now Bitch Right now Let's go Is Slink out there? Yes, sir. Does he want to rap? Uh, I, I told him uh, 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 not to rap? No, no, I told him to do a drop. Like, like at the end? Yeah, yeah oh, right. that's fine. wherever, wherever. Okay, okay that's fine. Yeah. Should right. I bring him in right now? No, 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 it's super, it's a lot of people in there. We'll have him come in after I finish. Finish up? Okay, yeah. perfect. Oh! I just, I just, so, second verse. So what, should, I, should I do a second verse or should we just have him talk? What do you think? It's actually low key formatted perfect for you to have a second verse. Let's go. Yeah. Uh, Girl, I'll fuck you. You in my house now. Oh, uh, it's going down right now. Let's go. Second verse. Girl, I'll fuck you. You in my house now. Oh, uh, it's going down right now. Fuck Miss Wright. Where's Miss Wright now? <laughs> That's the energy. <laughs> Fuck these bitches. Absolutely. It's going down right now. Fuck Miss Wright. Where's Miss Wright now? Let's start back from the top of that verse. Oh, that shit hard. Break down. Super build. Yeah. You ready? Yep. You in my house now. Uh, it's going down right now. Fuck Miss Wright. Where's Miss Wright now? Talking too loud. Pipe down. Before you sit. Oh, I like that. I like that. Living my Jeff life. Oh, I got that. Do it, do it. I got it. I got it. I like that. Living my Jeff life. You can kill that one. I'm, I'm going to fix it. It's going down right now. Fuck Miss Wright. Where's Miss Wright now? Talking too loud. Okay, one more time. Talking too loud. Bitch, pipe down. It's going down right now. Fuck Miss Wright. Where's Miss Wright now? Talking too loud. Bitch, pipe down. Let's go. Before you get your pretty ass pipe. <laughs> it's going down right now. Fuck Miss Wright. Where's Miss Wright now? Talking too loud. Bitch, pipe down. Before you get your pretty ass pipe down. <laughs> you in my house now. Uh, it's going down right now. Fuck Miss Wright. Where's Miss Wright now? Talking too loud. Bitch, pipe down. Before you get your pretty ass pipe down. Let's go. You in my. 
It's going down right now. Fuck Miss Right. Where's Miss Right now? Talking too loud. Bitch, pipe down before you get your pretty ass pipe down. Every day I'm. We're back on top of the verse. It's going down right now. Fuck Miss Right. Where's Miss Right now? Talking too loud. Bitch, pipe down before you get your pretty ass pipe down. It's going down right now. Fuck Miss Right. Where's Miss Right now? Talking too loud. Bitch, pipe down before you get your pretty ass pipe down. I'm here back from top of the verse. It's going down right now. Fuck Miss Right. Where's Miss Right now? Talking too loud. Bitch, pipe down before you get your pretty ass pipe down. Let's go. Before you get your Talking too loud. Bitch, pipe down. Before you get your pretty ass pipe down. I'm a type of nigga you should like now. It's going down right now. Fuck Miss Right. Where's Miss Right now? Talking too loud. Bitch, pipe down. Before you get your pretty ass pipe down. I'm a type of nigga you should like now. Give me a wipe. And after I lay it down, give me a wipe down. Alright, go. Now, I'm a type of nigga you should like now. Oh, can I get a mm -hmm. before you get your pretty ass pipe down? I'm a type of nigga you should like now. The way I put it down, I'm gonna lights out. You said what? The way I put her down, like a lights out. Let's go. <laughs> Before you get your pretty ass pipe down, I'm a type of nigga you should like now. The way I put it down. The way I put it down. The way I what? The way I put it down, like a lights out. The way I put it down. The way I put it down, like a lights out. Yeah. Before you get your pretty ass pipe down, I'm a type of nigga you should like now. The way I put it down, like a. The way I put it down, like a lights out. Before you get your pretty ass pipe down. I'm a type of nigga you should like now. The way I put it down, knock a lights out. It's going down go, right, go, now. Go, go, go. right now. I'm a type of nigga you should like now. The way I put it down, knock a lights out. Now she wanna get married and bring the rice out. Let me hear back on top of the verse, please. It's going down right now. Fuck Miss Right. Where's Miss Right now? Talking too loud. Bitch, pipe down before you get your pretty ass pipe down. I'm a type of nigga you should like now. The way I put it down, knock a lights out. Now she want to get married and bring the rice out. The honeymoon is over. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What's up? The honeymoon is over. I am sorry. I'm I'm a type of nigga you should like now. The way I put it down, knock a lights out. Now she wanna get married and bring the rice out. Soon as the honeymoon is over, I'm out. Let me get over it and get the back. Soon as a I'm a type of nigga you should like now. The way I put it down, knock a lights out. Now she wanna get married and bring the rice out. The honeymoon is over, I'm out. One more time. The honeymoon is over. I'm a type of nigga out. Now she wanna get married and bring the rice out. The way I put it down, knock a lights out. Now she wanna get married and bring the rice out. The honeymoon is over, I'm out. The honeymoon is over. Let me just get that line. Like the, soon as. You gotta hit the, soon as the honeymoon is over as soon as I'm out. Nah, as soon as the honeymoon is over. I'm out. As soon as the honeymoon is over, I'm out. The way I put it down, knock a lights out. Now she wanna get married and bring the rice out. Soon as the honeymoon is over, I'm out. One more time. Let me just get the first line first. The way I put it down, knock a lights out. Now she wanna get married and bring the rice out. Soon as the honeymoon is over. I'm out. 
Chicken, I'm out. Chicken, 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 I'm out. Chicken, chicken, I'm out. Now she wanna get married and bring the rice out. Soon as the honeymoon is over, chicken, I'm out. Let me just get the chicken. Chicken. Now just do it a little. Chicken, I'm out. Chicken, I'm out. Wanna get married and bring the rice out. Soon as the honeymoon is over, chicken, I'm out. Now she wanna get married and bring the rice out. Soon as the honeymoon is over, chicken, I'm out. Soon as the honeymoon is over, I'm out. Let me get back on top of that verse. It's going down right now. Fuck Miss Wright. Where's Miss Wright now? Talking too loud. Bitch, pipe down. Before you get your pretty ass pipe down. I'm the type of nigga you should like now. The way I put it down, knock a lights out. Now she wanna get married and bring the rice out. Soon as the honeymoon is over, I'm out. Halfway. Huh? Halfway. Okay. I hear back on top of that verse. It's going down right now. Fuck Miss Wright. Where's Miss Wright now? Talking too loud. Bitch, pipe down. Before you get your pretty ass pipe down. I'm the type of nigga you should like now. The way I put it down, knock the lights out. Now she want to get married and bring the rice out. Soon as the honeymoon is over, I'm out. Put a bad bitch on time out. I put a bad bitch on time out. Now she want to get married and bring the rice out. Soon as the honeymoon is over, I'm out. I put a bad bitch on time out. Soon as a honeymoon, I'm a type of nigga you should like now. The way I put it down, knock a lights out. Now she wanna get married and bring the rice out. Soon as a honeymoon is over, I'm out. I put a bad bitch on time out. It's all good. Hold on. <laughs> Let me hear back from top of the verse. It's going down right now. Fuck Miss Wright. Where's Miss Wright now? Talking too loud. Bitch, pipe down. Before you get your pretty ass pipe down. I'm the type of nigga you should like now. The way I put it down, knock the lights out. Now she want to get married and bring the rice out. Soon as the honeymoon is over, I'm out. I put a bad bitch on time out. Who's the one that wins the one Run back from the top of the song, please. Ah, uh, I just I ain't never wrapped over no house beat so, but I have snuck the blick in the house party before. But that's neither here nor there. We're all the hoes in front of. Whoa, uh, I'm in the house where the hoes at. I came to get it cracking and you know that. She got hella ass, she gon' show that. She been waiting all night just to throw it back. And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that. Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stretch that. And I'm a fat nigga, you ain't expect that. She ain't taking no singles, hit the cash at. Uh, I know she wanted from the back. Turn around, let me put my stomach on your back. You like that? I came in two minutes, but I'm right back. Round two and I'm in there. Haul up in that ass like swimwear. I pulled the bitch weave out, she got thin hair. It was a hell of a night, you should've been there. Girl, I'll fuck you. Girl, I'll fuck you. Girl, I'll fuck you. You in my house now. Girl, I'll fuck you. Girl, I'll fuck you. Girl, I'll fuck you. You in my house now. Uh, it's going down right now. Fuck Miss Wright. Where's Miss Wright now? Talking too loud. Bitch, pipe down. Before you get your pretty ass pipe down. I'm the type of nigga you should like now. The way I put it down, knock the lights out. Now she want to get married and bring the rice out. Soon as the honeymoon is over, I'm out. I put a bad bitch on time out. This is my kind of thing. I'm like, why do you sound a little lower than you were last time? <laughs> I'm like, hold on. Why am I having to raise these vocals up more than I should? Sack Town, play a shit is what I'm about. I put a bad bitch. You want, can you do that last part again for me? I put a bad bitch on timeout. Yeah. yeah. Just because this is, I don't like the way it sounds. As soon as the honeymoon is over, I'm out. I put a bad. Oh, I was recording. I tripped out. As soon as the honeymoon is over, I'm out. I put a bad bitch on time out. Good night. Too loud. It's cool. It's cool. As 
soon as the honeymoon is over, check it, I'm out. I put a bad bitch on timeout. Put a bad bitch on timeout. Me back on top of the verse. It's going down right now. Fuck Miss Right. Where's Miss Right now? Talking too loud. Bitch, pipe down. Before you get your pretty ass pipe down. I'm a type of nigga you should like now. The way I put it down, knock a lights out. Now she wanna get married and bring the rice out. Soon as the honeymoon is over, I'm out. I put a bad bitch on timeout. Let me hear that. Now she wanna get married and bring the rice out. Soon as the honeymoon is over, I'm out. I put a bad bitch on timeout. Let's go. Now she wanna get married and bring the rice out. Soon as the honeymoon is over, I'm out. I put a bad bitch on timeout. Quick calling me a trick cause I fly him out. <laughs> Wait, pause it, bad, pause it. Bad, bad. What are we gonna call this song? That's a good question. Great question. We can't call it "Girl, I'll Fuck You." Yeah, that's wild. <laughs> it's a little. Uh, <laughs> that's wild. Yeah. It's a little, uh, <laughs> uh, Maybe um, running from the top real quick. Let's running back from the top. Oh, I just. I ain't never rapped over no house beat so. But I have snuck the blick in the house party before, but that's neither here nor there. We're all the hoes in front of uh, I'm in the house where the hoes at. I can't even get it cracking if you know that. She got hella ass, she don't show that. She been waiting all night just to throw it back. And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that. Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stretch that. And I'm a fat nigga, you ain't expect that. She ain't taking no singles, hit the cash at. Uh, I know she wanted from the back. Turn around, let me put my stomach on your back. You like that? I came in two minutes, but I'm right back. Round two and I'm in there Haul up in that ass like swimwear I pulled the bitch weave out, she got thin hair It was a hell of a night, you should have been there Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you You in my house now Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you You in my house now uh, It's going down, right now Fuck Miss Right, where's Miss Right now? Talking too loud, bitch pipe down Before you get your pretty ass pipe down I'm a type of nigga you should like now. The way I put it down, knock a lights out. Now she wanna get married and bring the rice out. Soon as the honeymoon is over, I'm out. I put a bad bitch on timeout. Quit calling me a trick cause I fly him out. I think we could call it, um, My house? can you do that? I like can you do that. Or, 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 My or. House. somebody else said when I like it was, can you uh, do me like that? Can you do me like that? Or just do me like that. Do I, like, like, I like can you do that. Can, there you go. Just because, I mean, just... Can you do that? What yeah. was the original call? Wasn't it something about housing? No. Where we, where yeah, we it's the it? hook is... Where we know. sampled it from? What's uh, the name of the original song? Is it Feel the Vibe? It's, girl, it's I'll House You. I'll uh, House You? That's why I was thinking My House or whatever, because he's saying My House. Oh, it's called I'll House You? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, let's just call it I'll House You. I'll House You? Okay. I don't know. No, I don't know. I like my house too, or something. But can you? I like the other thing too. Yeah, yeah. Can, can you, you do, do that? that? I like this. Can you do that? Can you do that? I like that. Let's do that. Can you do that? All right. So let me just, let's finish up this verse. I put a bad bitch on timeout. Quit calling me a trick because I fly him out. So we got six bars left? Yeah. I put a bad bitch on timeout. Quit calling me a trick cause I fly him out. I'm trying to get a punch on this. 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 Go back, go back, go back.
I put a bad bitch on timeout. Quit calling me a trick cause I fly him out. Go back, go back, please. I put a bad bitch on timeout. Quit calling me a trick cause I fly him out. Put a bad bitch on timeout. Quit calling me a trick cause I fly him out. I put a bad bitch on timeout. Quit calling me a trick cause I fly him out. I'm trying to parallel park on a G spot. Have a coming all the time like a G shot. It's just getting filthier and filthier at this point. Yeah, I'm like, you're going crazy. <laughs> what I mean, it's called? <laughs> Girl, I'll fuck you. What you want me to talk about? Driving down Sunset in a Lamborghini? <laughs> what else am I supposed to talk about? Let me hear it back. Oh. One second, one second. I did something on accident. I accidentally did something crazy. Just a routing. Parallel parking on G spots. Parallel parking on G spot. <laughs> Covering all the time like a G shock. Let me get an electrocution sound right there. That's why them bitches that be using them rabbits. Uh, or oh, the rose. The rose. Uh, 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 uh. Concrete, what's the thing called? Jackhammer. Jackhammer, yeah. pussy. It's going dead. It's going down right now. Fuck Miss Wright. Where's Miss Wright now? Talking too loud. Bitch, pipe down. Before you get your pretty ass pipe down. I'm the type of nigga you should like now. The way I put it down, knock the lights out. Now she want to get married and bring the rice out. Soon as the honeymoon is over, chicka, I'm out. I put a bad bitch on timeout. Quit calling me a trick because I fly him out. I'm trying to parallel park on a G spot. Have her coming all the time like a G shot. So how you feel about rapping over a uh, house beat for the first time, though? Oh, man, it's part of course. It's fun. That's I, like it, man. I like to be able just to go different places creatively and not feel um, incumbent to have to do one you know, type. All the shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. All type shit. You push the envelope. Yeah. Yeah, facts. It's always good to step out the comfort zone and, uh, you know, press your limits of uh, yeah, yeah, creativity. Yeah. Absolutely. This is fun, though. This is something... <laughs> And it's like a Pornhub rap, which is ironic <laughs> because I'm like not having sex for 40 days. And I'm just like, I should have talking about a lot of sex for a nigga tonight. <laughs> well, maybe that's a way to get it out. Yeah, to get it out. Like, yeah. Just so, um, oh, so yeah. Right. I'm making it pretty good through my first day of my 40 day fast. That's right. <laughs> While I'm sitting here rapping about parallel parking on G-Spots. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a different type of nigga, man. Uh. How do you parallel park on a G spot? Hey man, oh, if you well, know, you know. Well, <laughs> <laughs> if you knew, you do. Eyes go. I put a bad bitch on timeout. Quit calling me a trick, cause I fly him out. I'm trying to parallel park on a G spot. Have a coming all the time like a G shot. That's the way. I'm trying to parallel park on a G spot. Have a coming all the time like a G shot. You like that? Let me hear about <laughs> oh, I put a bad bitch on timeout. Quit calling me a trick because I fly him out. I'm trying to parallel park on a G spot. Have a coming all the time like a G shot. You like that? <laughs> you like that? Oh, can you? We do this every single time, RDB. Can you go back a little bit further? I can't, I can't go that early. I, I don't have enough time. Have a coming all the time like a G-Shot. 
<laughs> you like that? Let me get up on the Hold on. You like, hold on. Come on, stick it. Let's go. Have a coming all the time like a G-Shot. You like that? I came again, but I ain't coming right back. Have a coming all the time like a G-Shot. You like that? I came again, but I ain't coming right back. <laughs> That's it, bitch. How about that second one? I need a sandwich, bitch. <laughs> I need a nap and a sandwich. I'm going to put that in the bar. You did good to come back from the sandwich. <laughs> a nap and a sandwich. <laughs> you like that? I came again, but I ain't coming right back. Yeah. Can you do that? Can you do that? Can you do that? I don't know. But somewhere I think we should put those can you do that in there. Like, okay, I'm down. Uh, let's get this last line. Let me, let me hear that on top of the verse. It's going down right now. Fuck Miss Right. Where's Miss Right now? Talking too loud. Bitch, pipe down. Before you get your pretty ass pipe down. I'm the type of nigga you should like now. The way I put it down, knock the lights out. Now she wanna get married and bring the rice out. Soon as her honeymoon is over, I'm out. I put a bad bitch on timeout. Quit calling me a trick cause I fly him out. I'm trying to parallel park on a G spot. Have a coming all the time like a G shot. You like that? I came again, but I ain't coming right back. You like that? I came again, but I ain't coming right back. Let's go. You like that? I came again, but I ain't coming right back. Now she confused and she don't understand it. Let's go. Let's go. I came again, but I ain't coming right back. Now she confused and she don't understand it. If you want round three, I need it. If you want round three, I need a nap and a sandwich, bitch. I came again, but I ain't coming right back. Now she confused and she don't understand. If you want round three, I need a nap and a. If you want round three, I need a nap and a sandwich, bitch. I came again, but I ain't coming right back. Now she confused and she don't understand. If you want, if you want, if you want round three, I need. Wait, wait, I need, I need a nap and a sandwich. If you want round three, I need a nap and a sandwich, bitch. I came again, but I ain't coming right back. Now she confused and she don't understand it. You want round? You want round three? I need a nap. That's what it is. You want round? Let's go. I came again, but I ain't coming right back. Now she confused and she don't understand it. You want round three? I need a nap and a sandwich, bitch. Can you turn that down a little bit? Because I feel like that sample comes in super loud, louder than everything. Girl, I'll fuck you. You and hey, come on, feel the vibe, feel the vibe, feel. Oh, I just, wait, pause it. Is it saying, can you feel it or can you do that? It sounds like she's saying, can you feel that? It's saying, can you feel it? Yeah, so why would we say, can you do that? I don't know. Okay. <laughs> can you feel it? That's, that's, that's what she's saying, right? Yeah. All right, let's name it a song, conclusion, can you feel it? All right. All right, let's run it back. <laughs> oh, I just, I ain't never rapped over no house beat, so... But I have snuck the blick in the house party before, but that's neither here nor there. We're all the hoes in front of. Whoa! Uh, I'm in the house where the hoes at. I came to get it cracking, and you know that. She got hella ass, she gon' show that. She been waiting all night just to throw it back. And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that. Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stretch that. And I'm a fat nigga, you ain't expect that. She ain't taking no singles, hit the cash that. Uh, I know she wanted from the back. Turn around, let me put my stomach on your back. You like that? I came in two minutes, but I'm right back. 
Round two and I'm in there All up in that ass like swimwear I pulled the bitch weave out, she got thin hair It was a hell of a night, you should have been there Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you You in my house now Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you You in my house now uh, It's going down right now Fuck Miss Right, where's Miss Right now? Talking too loud, bitch pipe down Before you get your pretty ass pipe down I'm a type of nigga you should like now The way I put it down, knock a lights out Now she wanna get married and bring the rice out Soon as the honeymoon is over, I'm out I put a bad bitch on timeout Quit calling me a trick cause I fly him out I'm trying to parallel park on a G-spot Have her coming all the time like a G-shot You like that? I came again, but I ain't coming right back. Now she confused and she don't understand it. You want round three, I need a nap and a sandwich, bitch. Girl, I'll fuck you. Girl, I'll fuck you. Girl, I'll fuck you. You in my house now. Girl, I'll fuck you. Girl, I'll fuck you. Girl, I'll fuck you. You in my house now. Hey, can you put that feel the vibe shit that you just had right there on the first step too? I like that. I think that's dope. Yeah, that sounds really good. I'm in the house where the hoes at I came to get it cracking and you know that She got hella ass, she gon' show that She been waiting all night just to throw it back And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stretch that And I'm a fat nigga, you ain't expect that She ain't taking no singles, hit the cash at Uh, I know she want it from the back Turn around, let me put my stomach on your back You like that? I came in two minutes, but I'm right back Round two and I'm in there All up in that ass like swimwear I pulled the bitch weave out, she got thin hair It was a hell of a night, you should have been there Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, yeah. I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you You in my house now Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you You in my house now uh, It's going down right now Fuck Miss Right, where's Miss Right now? Talking too loud, bitch pipe down Before you get your pretty ass pipe down I'm a type of nigga you should like now The way I put it down, knock a lights out Now she wanna get married and bring the rice out Soon as the honeymoon is over, I'm out I put a bad bitch on timeout Quit calling me a trick cause I fly him out I'm trying to parallel park on a G-spot Have her coming all the time like a G-shot You like that? I came again but I ain't coming right back Now she confused and she don't understand it You want round three, I need a nap and a sandwich, bitch Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you You in my house now Girl, I'll fuck you. Girl, I'll fuck you. Girl, I'll fuck you. You in my house now. I love it. Dang. Round of applause. How long is the song total? Uh, it was a little short. It's like a minute and 45. Well, Still getting slink on it? I don't know. Does it need Slink on? Does he want to hop on? I mean, I don't know really what's to be at. Play it again from the beginning. I just don't want to add things just to add things. Oh! I just... I ain't never rapped over no house beat, so... But I have snuck the blick in a house party before. But that's neither here nor there. We're all the hoes in front of. Whoa! Uh, I'm in the house where the hoes at. I came to get it cracking and you know that. She got hella ass. She gon' show that. She been waiting all night just to throw it back. And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stretch that And I'm a fat nigga, you ain't expect that She ain't taking no singles, hit the cash at Uh, I know she want it from the back Turn around, let me put my stomach on your back You like that? I came in two minutes, but I'm right back Round two and I'm in there All up in that ass like swimwear I pulled the bitch weave out, she got thin hair It was a hell of a night, you should have been there Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you You in my house now Oh, I just, I ain't never rapped over no house beat, so, but I have snuck the blick in a house party before, but that's neither here nor there. We're all the hoes in front of. Oh, uh, I'm in the house where the hoes at. I can't get it cracking and you know that. She got hella ass. She gon' show that. Oh, uh, I just, I ain't never rapped over no house beat, so. But I have snuck the blick in a house party before, but that's neither here nor there. We're all the hoes in front of. Oh, uh, I'm in the house where the hoes at. 
I came to get it cracking and you know that She got hella ass, she gon' show that She been waiting all night just to throw it back And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stretch that And I'm a fat nigga, you ain't expect that She ain't taking no singles, hit the cash app Uh, I know she want it from the back Turn around, let me put my stomach on your back You like that? I came in two minutes, but I'm right back Round two and I'm in there Haul up in that ass like swimwear I pulled the bitch weave out, she got thin hair It was a hell of a night, you should have been there Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you You in my house now Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you You in my house now uh, It's going down, right now Fuck Miss Right, where's Miss Right now? Talking too loud, bitch pipe down Before you get your pretty ass pipe down I'm a type of nigga you should like now The way I put it down, knock the lights out Now she wanna get married and bring the rice out Soon as her honeymoon is over, chicka, I'm out I put a bad bitch on timeout Quit calling me a trick cause I fly him out I'm trying to parallel park on a G-spot Have her coming all the time like a G-shot You like that? I came again but I ain't coming right back Now she confused and she don't understand it You want round three, I need a nap and a sandwich, bitch Girl, I'll fuck you I don't know. I think maybe just loop the beat at the end and just let it house it out. You know what I mean? Yeah, I think. Yeah, like, yeah. Break it. Uh, just loop it out like, I just, like, I ain't never rapped over no house beats. I'm a beast. In response, so I know you. Mm -hmm. I, I don't know. I don't have a visual cue from another. Can you just loop it out at the end? Cool. Ah. Uh, I just, I ain't never rapped over no house beats, so. But I have snuck the blick in the house party before, but that's neither here nor there. We're all the hoes in Toronto. Whoa! Uh, uh, I'm in the house where the hoes at. I came to get it cracking and you know that. She got hella ass, she gon' show that. She been waiting all night just to throw it back. And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that. Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stretch that. And I'm a fat nigga, you ain't expect that. She ain't taking no singles, hit the cash app. Uh, I know she want it from the back. Turn around, let me put my stomach on your back. You like that? I came in two minutes, but I'm right back. Round two and I'm in there Haul up in that ass like swimwear I pulled the bitch weave out, she got thin hair It was a hell of a night, you should've been there Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you You in my house now Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you You in my house now uh, It's going down right now Fuck Miss Right, where's Miss Right? Be the craziest shit. This, this one fuck around and be the one that goes triple platinum. Cause you can never tell what's gonna happen. This song is silly enough to be a hit. You in my house now. Yeah, I like that. Where are we at with the artwork, Clue? Working on it. Um, I had to switch up from where I was at. Yeah, so what do you think the time was? Yeah, the ETA on the... Artwork? Clip. What happened? Hold, hold on, buddy. I said, what's your ETA for the artwork? Um, I'm almost... I had to switch up where I was at with it to, um... The house type vibe, so. Okay, so do you know how long it's gonna take you to do? Mm. Well, I'm just like, I'm just saying, like, we're wrapped up, so we're just waiting on you now. Okay. Right. <laughs> hey, yo, the vibe. How you feel about the record, man? That's great. We got one in. Come on now. I'm shocked. I didn't think I was gonna be able to. I, I don't wanna say I didn't think I was gonna be able to deliver, but I was just like, this is gonna be. And plus, I knew I hadn't eaten today. <laughs> so I was just like, this is going to be interesting. But, yeah. you know. You did it. We, we came in there, man. You did the thing. You guys definitely wow. set the the, uh, the the template. 
You know what I'm saying? So. Look, and it woke us up. Yeah, absolutely. Woke you up. Boom. Feel the vibes. Come on. So you got any new projects that you're working on right now that's going to be coming out soon? I'm working on some things, possibly for BBE, once I figure it out, um, out of London. Okay. And you know, they do hip-hop stuff, a lot of uh, underground hip-hop and some mainstream. They did uh, one of Jeff's albums Okay. some years ago he did out, but I've been putting out singles with them here and there, so I'm, work I'm waiting on the artists now to finish their track so I can get them all mixed and done nice. and sent to the okay. label, so it's a little... Little house, little house, a little, yeah, kind of neo soulish. Like a couple of them, a couple gotcha. tracks on there, but it's like two, two of those, two neo souls and two, uh, three house. Nice. So. I think we might have a smash on our hands, man. We might have a smash. Right. What's the uh, name of the song again? Uh, Can, uh, you feel it? Can you feel it? Can you feel it? Yeah. You almost, you you ready with the artwork? Not yet, but almost. This is a pretty good episode. We mm -hmm. got through and we hit our time markers. Pretty much. We know, it's 305. Well, yeah, we're done. Yeah, we go a little over. I mean, you don't need to be like... Uh... Oh, it doesn't have to be like... Right. No, no, I'm just saying that yeah. it's cool to have an episode to be around the time. Can I get the other... Yeah. I just think it's cool to, you know, if... Somebody says smash. Smash is a good name, that but I mean, the nigga already we has changed it like four times. Changed the name. Um, I think "Can You Feel It" is a more yeah. Um, I think that uh, you know, we're trying to get the show to be a three-hour show. If it, our goal is as an objective with you know with the show, we say we'll never start after twelve because starting at twelve for a morning show is already ridiculous enough. So whenever that was our goal starting like three, four weeks ago is being like, we won't start later than 12, but we can't, we don't know how long it'll go. Um, but, you know, you can stay for as long as you want or, you know, take and, you know, you can kind of go out, come back in, whatever, whatever. But to kind of have a full episode to where I felt like it was cool. Me and Slink got to talk at the top for like 20 to 30 minutes. Me and bro got to holla, you know what I'm saying, for 30 to 40 minutes. We hopped in the uh, the cook up. The cook up went good. The beat didn't take super long. Didn't take me super long to deliver on the lyrics. Didn't take him super long to deliver, and now we're good. So I feel great. We ready with the uh, artwork? We close? Yeah, we're close. Um, yeah, one second. And I made it halfway through my first day of my fast nice um like i said i could do anything one day so today is probably going to be today and tomorrow are probably going to be my more difficult days like i didn't work out today i'm probably not going to work out tomorrow just because i'm just going to allow myself to feel how i feel and then probably wednesday i'll be like all right let's go start working out let's you know start moving around then i think probably by thursday or friday my body will be what are you looking at me like that oh okay um then i think my body will uh shift over to burning stored fat cells i might this is this could be we'll see but i was 311 pounds this morning and i'm i'm starting my seven day i mean my 40 day water fast today i, I don't know why i keep laughing when i say that but um i might be out of the threes very soon and the next time i leave the threes i will never move back into that neighborhood it's a shitty neighborhood i will never move back into the 300s so we're going to be out of there very soon. Are we close with the artwork? Yes. Huh?
Yes, sir. All right, let's run the record. Uh, Can You Feel It? Produced by my boy YDB featuring featuring Blizzy Most, yeah, your yeah. boy Doughboy. Let's get it. Oh, uh, I just, I ain't never rapped over no house beat, so, but I have snuck the blick in the house party before, but that's neither here nor there. We're all the hoes that's trying to, oh, uh, I'm in the house where the hoes at. I came to get it cracking and you know that. She got hella ass, she gon' show that. She been waiting all night just to throw it back. And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that. Get the magnum off the dress, so I'ma stretch that. And I'm a fat nigga, you ain't expect that. Pause she ain't it, taking no it. singles, hit the cat. Are we not ready with the artwork? I said almost. I'm, I'm putting the uh, parental advisory up and we ready to go. You can play it one time for the one time till we, till we get there. It's, it's pretty much there though. I go, you uh, I just, I ain't never rapped over no house beat, so, but I have snuck the blick in the house party before, but that's neither here nor there. We're all the hoes that's trying to, uh, I'm in the house where the hoes at, I came to get it cracking and you know that, she got hella ass, she gon' show that, she been waiting all night just to throw it back. And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stretch that And I'm a fat nigga, you ain't expect that She ain't taking no singles, hit the cash app Uh, I know she want it from the back Turn around, let me put my stomach on your back You like that? I came in two minutes, but I'm right back Round two and I'm in there Haul up in that ass like swimwear I pulled the bitch weave out, she got thin hair It was a hell of a night, you should have been there Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you You in my house now Girl, I'll fuck you. Girl, I'll fuck you. Girl, I'll fuck you. You in my house now. Uh, it's going down right now. Fuck Miss Wright. Where's Miss Wright now? Talking too loud. Bitch, pipe down. Before you get your pretty ass pipe down. I'm a type of nigga you should like now. The way I put it down, knock a lights out. Now she want to get married and bring the rice out. Soon as her honeymoon is over, I'm out. I put a bad bitch on timeout. Quit calling me a trick because I fly him out. I'm trying to parallel park on a G spot. Have her coming all the time like a G shot. You like that? I came again, but I ain't coming right back. Now she confused and she don't understand it. You walk round three, I need a nap and a sandwich, bitch. Girl, I'll fuck you. Girl, I'll fuck you. Girl, I'll fuck you. You in my house now. Girl, I'll fuck you. Girl, I'll fuck you. Girl, I'll fuck you. You in my house now. Yeah. Is that like a coin? <laughs> the cash register. I said it's fire. All right. I like it. Are we ready with the artwork? Yes, sir. It's All right. We're going to run the rec. You said what? It's uploading right now to the to the system. All right, Blizzy Mo, you want to let the people know where they can find you at, man? Plug your socials, all that good stuff. Let the people know where they can reach you at, see you at. Yes, indeed. Uh, you can follow me on all platforms under Blizzy Mos. B-L-I-Z-Z-Y-M-O-S-T. Boom. Thank you for coming and uh, cooking up with us on the Morning Cup of Dough show, man. You're definitely more than welcome to pull up whenever you like, man. You def I definitely appreciate your flavor. This definitely took me out of my comfort zone. I think we might mess around and have a hit for the uh, for the streets this summer, so we're going to see. You ready to run this uh, record one more time, YDB? One, nice. Mm. I just wanna do one more today. It's good to sometimes step out the box. You always uh, yeah, step definitely. out that circle. Yeah, you just don't want to always be you know, doing comfortable the same thing. doing the same thing. It's boring. Yeah. Try something else. Absolutely. Absolutely. Are we good? All right, here we go. And Can You Feel It? Produced by YDB and Blizzy Most featuring Doughboy. Let's go. Uh, I just, I ain't never rapped over no house beat, so, but I have snuck the blick in the house party before, but that's neither here nor there. We're all the hoes that's trying to. Uh, pause it, pause it, pause it. I'm in the house it. where the hoes at. You want to let me know when you're ready with the artwork, please, conclusion? It's, a, it's the delay. It's up. It's super delayed today. Okay. Uh, 
I just, I ain't never rapped over no house beat, so, but I have snuck the blick in the house party before, but that's neither here nor there. We're all the hoes that's trying to, oh, uh, I'm in the house where the hoes at. I came to get it cracking and you know that She got hella ass, she gon' show that She been waiting all night just to throw it back And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stretch that And I'm a fat nigga, you ain't expect that She ain't taking no singles, hit the cash at Uh, I know she want it from the back Turn around, let me put my stomach on your back You like that? I came in two minutes, but I'm right back Round two and I'm in there all up in that ass like swimwear I pulled the bitch weave out, she got thin hair It was a hell of a night, you should've been there Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you You in my house now Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you You in my house now uh, It's going down right now Fuck Miss Right, where's Miss Right now? Talking too loud, bitch pipe down Before you get your pretty ass pipe down I'm a type of nigga you should like now The way I put it down, knock a lights out Now she wanna get married and bring the rice out Soon as her honeymoon is over, I'm out I put a bad bitch on time out Quit calling me a trick cause I fly him out I'm trying to parallel park on a G spot Have her coming all the time like a G shot You like that? I came again but I ain't coming right back Now she confused and she don't understand it You want round three, I need a nap and a sandwich, bitch Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you You in my house now Girl, I'll fuck you. Girl, I'll fuck you. Girl, I'll fuck you. You in my house now. Yeah. And hold on, don't don't cut the thing. Hold on, scroll back up for one second. Scroll back up on those comments, because I'm about to address this right now. We're not going to do this. Please take the artwork down for two seconds. Okay, you ain't got to scroll it up. Somebody was, what was that, Miss Kiwi said that Doughboy is snappy today. No, Doughboy is not snappy today. At the end of the day, in addition to being talent, on this, we all have to be producers and we all have to make sure that the show runs a certain way. So I'm not being snappy at all. I'm not snappy. I am a little hungry. <laughs> so that is that. But I'm not being snappy at all. So when you guys see me, like sometimes you'll see me in producer mode. And it's just producer. It's not me being rude. It's not me being, you know, jumping on people. It's like, no, it's like, hey, you know, where are we going on this? So let's run. Uh, um, did you want to put the artwork up and explain the artwork to the people? Okay. Okay. So. I mean, obviously, you guys were talking about uh, where you said in-house, it was housing was the original, so I wanted it in the house um, at the end. Like, I, I was going in a different direction, and I was like, all right, let me bring it in the house um, just to tie it in. Now, I brought the female, because you're talking about a female. Obviously, it's sexy. It's it's sex-driven. So her T-shirt, because you're, you're like, talking about not Miss Right now, not Miss Right, but Miss Right now. So I mean, obviously, she kind of, you know, solidifies that <laughs> and on her shirt it says good girls love bad boys Jeez. so you're you're talking that crazy talk and she's you know what i mean she's pretty yeah. much saying she's down with the business and she ain't trying to get wifed up either so she kind of fit my um direction of where you guys were going with the song to the direction i had in my head so i found her i thought she was dope for it found a dope house it was like kind of trying to find a dope house that fit her being in the center. I wanted her a centerpiece, feel me? Mm. Um, um, and then the, you know, the rest tied in the can you feel it and all that. Right. I like it, man. It's all good. All right. Um, so yeah, we're gonna, uh, hold on. Miss Kiwi says, Clue had it up and ready. Just seemed like, no, I wasn't snapping at him at all. No, I it's wasn't. just that there's a long delay and sometimes right. it um, it throws us off. Like if he tells me, hey, put the, the video up and then right. the, the delay in the room is like, 15 20 seconds behind it looks like i'm not doing my job right and so uh, and, that, and it's, just, it's just a confusion of, yeah. of how the internet works because in in my in front of me is in real time but in front of them they're not seeing what i'm seeing in real time they're seeing what i'm seeing 15 20 seconds later right. and it's even worse today because right. today there's some kind of lag and i've seen it even on my end there's some kind of lag so um yeah it's just it's 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 not um anyone's fault it's just kind of how 
the internet works sometimes. Yeah. Well, it's all good. Man. I feel like, you know, um, and yeah, just to, just to let you guys know, like, even like, you know, even like when I was, um, when I was, you know, even when I was just saying it to him, it's just because I want the, you know, the artwork to be up during when the song is up, just so, you know, so you guys can, you know what I mean? Um, enjoy it at the same time. So it's all good. Just wanted to clear that up. We're going to run the record one more time with the artwork up before we get out of here. I want to thank our guest, Blizzy Most, for coming through. Appreciate you, brother. Thank you, YDB, for always doing what you do. Thank you, Conclusion, for always doing what you do. Thank you to the big bro, Slink Johnson, for coming through and pulling up on us. We will see you guys at the same place, same time tomorrow, 12 o'clock. Uh, morning cup of dough and we have some uh we have a real big show coming up next week for the 100th episode so make sure on april 2nd you guys are tuned in we're gonna have some big guests some big surprises and it's gonna be lit let's run the record one more time and let's get up out of here peace one oh i just i ain't never rapped over no house beat so but i have snuck the blick in a house party before but that's neither here nor there we're all the hoes that's trying to oh uh. I'm in the house for the hoes that I came to get it cracking and you know that She got hella ass, she gon' show that She been waiting all night just to throw it back And I'm a real nigga, I'ma catch that Get the magnum off the dress, I'ma stretch that And I'm a fat nigga, you ain't expect that She ain't taking no singles, hit the cash app Uh, I know she want it from the back Turn around, let me put my stomach on your back You like that? I came in two minutes, but I'm right back Round two and I'm in there Haul up in that ass like swimwear I pulled the bitch weave out, she got thin hair It was a hell of a night, you should have been there Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you You in my house now Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you You in my house now uh, It's going down, right now Fuck Miss Wright, where's Miss Wright now? Talking too loud, bitch pipe down Before you get your pretty ass pipe down I'm the type of nigga you should like now The way I put it down, knock the lights out Now she wanna get married and bring the rice out Soon as the honeymoon is over, I'm out I put a bad bitch on timeout Quit calling me a trick cause I fly him out I'm trying to parallel park on a G spot Have her coming all the time like a G shot You like that? I came again but I ain't coming right back Now she confused and she don't understand it You walk round three, I need a nap and a sandwich, bitch Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you Girl, I'll fuck you You in my house now Girl, I'll fuck you. Girl, I'll fuck you. Girl, I'll fuck you. You in my house now. Yeah. Shout out to all the mods. Shout out to the chat. Shout out to everybody tuned in across the planet. The morning cup of dough. We out here. Tune in tomorrow. Same bat channel. Same dough channel, same dough time. Same place, same time. Bye.